and we are back live and i am joined by the marvelous ghibli jam thank you very much i am joined by the french paradox yes and we had a war well someone had a war before a producer cast was left and now we're back in and it looks to be the murder of orisa live on screen for your entertainment they started a war more than two hours ago, actually. Let's, let's see. That, that war started in, yeah, 20 years ago. They started a war. They got all the way to 48% war score, but they got stuck, unable to peace out. And I guess, I, I guess, like, the other side just spent the rest of that time trying to find allies. And they finally got people like, you know what? I'll take a piece of India for, 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 for myself. Thank you very much. And they now got Serbia, Somalia, and Hassa just ravaging their uh, their countries. Although although they managed to kick them out, actually. But yeah, they did. It seems like Orissa did the typical EU4 greedy thing. They didn't want to peace out with what they had and instead thought that they would be able to wait it out and attrit um, Malacca. But it looks like Malacca was also playing the same game. And with naval superiority, they were able to stop them from yeah. crossing. And it was just... All over Red Rover. Because they went in with a lot of heavies, but they lost them in two bad battles early. And after that, it was just sit on both sides of the Strait of Malacca and hope that the other side will just accept your demands. And I don't know whatever demands they were uh, and how much people were willing to uh, to sign on them. But clearly, clearly, those demands were not accepted. And then instead of just pissing out, and, and the age absolutism start, absolute time for absolutism. Do we have some cool age bonus system? Yes. France is about to get 20% fire damage. Why is it not permanent? I don't know, but they should get that soon. Uh, Sweden or Scandinavia could get insane manpower recovery speed if uh, Livonia managed to bribe Caesar to form Scandinavia. But I think that those bribes are out of the way now that they rebelled against the emperor. Manchu could also uh, start getting their banners, which are pretty strong. And on top of that, of course, we have absolutism, and we'll see how much people uh, will push for more absolutism. Um, Doesn't look like there's too, too much expansion left to be had. All borders are basically closed at this point, so it's really up to the really big alliances. We are in the aftermath of a huge world war against the kingdom oh, of God. And someone has decided to play Kingmaker there because Japan, Gotland, Korea, and Manchu have decided to jump Brunei and Malacca in a different war. Oh. So this is not over for Orisa. Thank you. <laughs> Japan, of course, bringing very strong navy. Yeah, because the, the numbers, how much how much boats, because they have been sitting there for a long time. They could have invested in how much, oh, they have. Gotland has 60 heavies now. Uh, Japan 14, but uh, Japan has 90 galleys. Oh, now we're going to have some cool naval engagements, I'm, I'm hoping. Let's see, what does Japan take any naval idea? They took maritime, actually. Yes. Oh, boy. We love that. Look at them. 128 ships oh, strong. And down. they have landed the ore in the northern tip of Brunei. We are seeing <laughs> a very <laughs> early royal replay of World War II <laughs> with Japan invading uh, uh, Brunei and the Philippines. Uh, this is <laughs> this is looking really weirdly like <laughs> 1941. Yeah, I've uh, seen this one before. <laughs> someone want to play Roosevelt's speech about December a date that will live in infamy. Sorry, I uh, I work on Hoy. I can't I can't I can't escape it. <laughs> oh, is Nepal seems no. Are they mobilizing at the border? No. Oh, they are recruiting a lot, but they're not in the battle. I wonder if people probably running through the castle, not trying to find some. Uh, Trying to find some help, trying to find some more people uh, to join their side, maybe. And what's curious is is that Somalia is also in this war, especially with their uh, island vassal down in the tip of India. Yeah, they tried an early raid, but I think they were pushed back by Orisa or just didn't want to take their chances. Yeah, they don't seem to be doing too, too much right now towards the war effort, but they do have a rather large navy they've got 25 lights did they lose their heavies it does look like they did in fact lose their heavies yeah like the, the, i think brunei and, and before the incursion of Gotland and japan malacca and brunei had managed to achieve naval supremacy in the region but now this is gonna be super strongly challenged uh but orisa has raised an impressively big army how much do they got now oh wow that's that's an amount of stacks 
Let's see. Uh oh, Kingdom of God is now in another war, moving oh, back to Europe. Oh, silly Switzer Switzerland. It is the Wait, how is Switzerland back on the map? Swabia has decided to go back from to Switzerland. Switzerland. Okay. Yeah, and it is. The War of the Protestant League. Yeah. <laughs> Switzerland has decided <laughs> that they would attack Sicily and, and, and create the League War. Uh, the numbers are clearly not in their favors because they only they have only themselves <laughs> against oh, Andalusia, no. Bavaria, Caribbean, the Kingdom of God, and Romania and Serbia. Who is going to join it, though? This might be the smallest League War I've ever seen. Yes. <laughs> it's, it is probably going to be. Uh, and I, I respect them for trying, at least. We're like, you know what? It's a Protestant <laughs> League of Two versus One. Let's have at it. Uh, yet, so they started this war without actually training the troops. Uh, I just see their morale go up. So either they just got attacked or they just have forgot to pay the men before the war started. That's a bit of an oopsie. Let's see. Oh, yeah, and I can see Switzerland's vassal or like voting for someone else <laughs> to be the emperor. <laughs> Like, can France become the emperor, maybe? <laughs> the HRE only has... Three electors yeah, remaining. One of them unable to vote because of the League War. This is going to be an interesting tie. Uh, Gotland's involvement, they are in the Brunei War. Yeah, they, they are. Uh, Japan is just rampaging Brunei right now. And Brunei is, like, unwilling to take the fight, trying to maneuver around those jungles, figuring out what's the good battle to take. Because uh, maybe I don't. Japan has not been tested in in uh, on land a lot. They did intervene in the battle before. Oh, I see. Siam is building a lot of troops. Nepal has stopped training their guys. Is any one of those gonna throw in this fight, or are they still gonna sit around? It is. It is everybody's guess. Orissa has murdered an amount of troops. I was checking that just before. They have. Oh, they went way over the force limit by 226 out of 154. Oh. They're paying 90 extra ducats a month. This is costing them 180 each month just to be able to maintain that insanely big army. And I don't think anybody is just like giving them money to bankroll that kind of expense. They only have 17 loans out, so if so they, they can win the war, they should be able to economically be all right but again this has been a 20-year war so yes their pockets are hurting and this war is raging also in the new world because right now united states is blockading gotland who is norse and uh, oh did the u.s throw in the battle mm -hmm. yes the u.s has joined the side of brunei <laughs> this is getting crazy again the u.s is oh are they going for are they, are they using that as a pretext to go for gotland and will texas also join texas Te is not in yet but they are allied to the u.s so we'll see they are still drilling yeah but yeah i think the u.s is just using that as a pretext to invade mexico basically oh and oh Wait. They are landing. Yeah, they are landing because because Gotland's like actual like fighting fleet is stuck on the other side of the Pacific, <laughs> and they can't even go through. Uh, yeah, of course they don't have Panama yet, so that would take a while for them to bring them back in. And in the meantime, they America is landing on <laughs> Cuba. This is the Bay of Pigs. Hopefully, it will go better. Oh. It seems to be going better than the Bay of Pigs so far, because Gotland has no troops. They have eighteen k standing on the. Uh, on on Haiti and that is it. Uh, that and they they don't have control of the seas. They don't even have any cogs. Oh, they have no. They don't have cogs. They have their two fleets stuck in ports and we've like twenty three heavies blocking them, forcing them to stay inside. That's going to be interesting. Siam is not in the Orissa Malacca war, which is a bit of an interesting choice for them. They do stand to gain if they were to join yeah. either side, realistically. Oh, Serbia is making a move through... Oh, they have moved all the way through Nepal and they're pouring down, like, uh, what is it, Burma. And I think they're going to try to attack the Orison from the back, going down from the Malayan Peninsula, instead of trying to go through Mewa like they did the last time. Which means maybe Somalia and Hassa... They can put them in the two-front war, right? Because Orissa clearly doesn't have the... They might have the number. I don't know. Brunei is attacking into Japan right now on Borneo. 
But oh, oh, it looks oh, like how's Japan that going? How's has... that going? How's that going? Let's see, let's see. We can't miss that battle. Oh, 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 wow. Japan does not have the numbers. Oh, but they got wiped before they could reinforce. Oh, ah, no. that isn't good. That's painful. Let's, let's, oh, yeah. They have a big disadvantage in both morale and discipline and the general. And we're taking a battle in the jungle. Uh, that is, those are not good numbers. And Japan is force marching down. Um, I oh oh that hurts. Depending oh. on if Brunei has additional troops here, though, Japan might just win. Oh no! No, I, I don't think they oh. have anything. They're running away. Yeah. They're like, fuck me! I need to take my losses right now. <laughs> uh, this is this is not gonna go well. Uh, I think their best shot is um, because if Orisa actually managed to pull back with the help of no, because Serbia is against them. So this is really a free front war. Like it 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 it. Did, did, did Gotland change, change sides? Because, I mean, uh, by, sorry, I did they try to go back home uh, under the threat of American invasion or not? Where are the Gotland fleets right now? Uh, no, that's the Gotland armies. has 232 lights in Central America, but they oh, do I... not have their... Why did someone hide the navies from the thing? 60 ships right now are docked outside of Zimbabwe. Oh no! Yeah, they, no, and their main now. oh, their main thing is coming back. They coming are back. coming back. They have to go all the way across the Horn of Africa, but they are coming back. They left the the, the scene, uh, so that balances out the numbers a bit because now it's only relying on Japan numbers to. US uh, is landing though more troops, so we'll see. Yeah, I think this was a good move from the US to force them back on. Now the question, will Serbia make the difference? What is Nepal going to do? They have lots of troops. They're not drilling. They're just sitting. What are they waiting for? Is it going to be another? Maybe for plotting something else. It's it's hard to tell what they're going to do. Orisa uh, is still bleeding money, obviously, from, from this. And they're absolutely, like, they burnt all the manpower, raising that huge army right now. They do have some professionalism they can burn. Uh, oh, the Kingdom of God is already at peace, so I'm assuming that the the oh, War of the League... Uh, oh, and they... Oh, they, they, oh the, the cowards, they went for the Peace of Westphalia. Uh, they just white peace this one out. I thought the Emperor would, like... Um, well, I mean, I don't know. <laughs> it's, the Emperor was a bit silly, I'm not gonna lie, but... We Stefan von Silly. <laughs> we have um, Great Britain renting 1K condo troops to Malacca. One? Oh, 1K. Oh, is it just to see what's happening? I think up there? so. Otherwise, but, but why? not really. But they're not moving, so they're like, yeah. we're doing our part. <laughs> okay, Brunei is recovering now. They have raised an. Oh, that that must be Mercs. But they have raised an impressive number of troops down. Yeah, they have. We have murked up like crazy. And I guess they're hoping to push Japan out of here. They might be able to pull the numbers to beat them now because Gotland has gone away. Oh, and we're going to have a, a naval battle because they saw Japan and I think they know now that Gotland has just... Went, no, they're not taking that battle. And if the U.S. times... Oh, they're, they're waiting for Malacca, maybe. If they time a naval battle right, they will be able to take out Gotland's main fleet that is suffering from attrition right now. So I wonder if the U.S. is prepared for that. Oh yeah, I uh, I don't I oh I see it and I see it now like in the Java Sea. Uh, they have noticed that no, come on, push. Ah, uh, they are, yes, they are going. They are going for Japan. They know that Japan does not have the support of uh, of Gotland anymore. And now maybe they might be able to pull the numbers. They do not do. They don't have enough galleys for this. No. It's a lot of heavies, but no gal. Oh no, they are winning. Those, those, oh no, I just looked at the number. Yeah, they have a bigger engagement. Oh yeah, they just murdered them. Japan Navy has been sent packing, so even if they get Borneo... Oh, so the play there is that if if Japan lose naval superiority, then their home island is under threat because they have nothing to defend them. If Brunei is willing to burn... They can, uh, and, 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 or if Japan, Japan, if, if Japan gets pushed back of Borneo, they have no way home. And this battle is going to be one of them. They are still taking a lot of damage because discipline and morale are really not on their side. I haven't checked Miltech. Uh, Japan, Malacca is, uh, no, Japan is on Miltech 17. Uh, that is... Malacca is 16. Yeah. Oh God. And are they gonna Brunei reinforce in time? 17. Are they gonna reinforce in time? Oh God. They're just taking so many losses. Oh. Very reinforcing time, but they are like their reserves are already 
almost depleted compared to what Japan has. This is, I don't think they're going to pull. Oh no, Mal Malacca is running. They are, they are faring more and more troops to the island because now they have, no, they're pulling out. They, they, they know they're not going to win this one. They, they don't have the firepower. They, they, they entirely rely on the fact that Japan cannot uh, make a move here. Uh, oh, and Korea is, is yeah, Korea has been invading the Philippines in the meantime. So they entirely we don't, we rely on their wooden wall and the wooden wall has been kind of lacking so far. Oh, and Maywar, wait, Maywar has entered the war. Yes, Maywar has finally decided to join with Nepal on the Orison side. That against could be a game changer. <laughs> Yes, because they have a good foothold on the continent and all the other invaders have basically, they need to go across straits or worse, across oceans or across a huge continent in the case of Serbia. Mewar, though, only has 31 transports and two light ships, so they are not prepared navally for this. Yes, yeah. Well, Japan might be able to do some damage, but I'm thinking the other, like, the Orisons gang will probably get end up stuck in the same place they were before, willing, unable to cross into Indonesia proper. Uh, even if they can win on land, they might not be able to kick them out. Um, yeah, Brunei, Brunei is... Oh, did they just get a new tech? Because I see that they... No, they just... I think they're raising more troops. They have... They're also bleeding money, but I'm assuming they can raise some form of a wall chest if they need to. Now we have, yeah, Korea is, is raging on their home island and um, and Japan is still burning Brunei and they just cannot get the numbers to beat them back due to that military uh, level difference. They do have quality and expansion, but that's uh, that's that's the only uh, military uh, things. They, oh, they have 10% morale on their base idea. It's not too bad, but it's just not cutting it right now. It looks like the U.S. fleet lost to Gotland when they brought their ships home and returned. They are currently in healing mode. They've got 56k troops stuck in Cuba. This is this is a new, we need a new setup for those for those world wars. One of us <laughs> is following like the, the Philippine front, and someone is following the American. Oh God, yes, Gotland has managed to put some troops on the Dominican Republic slash Haiti, but. The U.S. are seriously occupying Cuba. They have not made a move from Mexico yet. I thought they were going to do it, but they seem to have diverted all the troops. Uh, I think they got stopped by Gotland's fleet, which is now back. Yeah, this is a weird three-way war, because, yeah, didn't the U.S. is also against Japan and Gotland? Yeah, this is an interesting three-way war. But, but Got no, Japan is the main attacker, so they need to get Japan out of it. Maybe if they peace out Gotland, though. If they manage to force out Gotland out of the war, then America might be able to, well, I guess, do an early replay of World War II and, and, and <laughs> go to the Pacific <laughs> and try to invade the home island because, again, they have lost naval supremacy. Uh, Japan does need to get back on the boat side if they want to be able to win this. And I think Brunei has noticed, yeah, they locked their fleet. Their fleet is now stuck in um, what is Mindanao. And they're just waiting. They're like, nope, you're not going anywhere. Oh, that's Korea. Is that just Korea? Where's the Japanese fleet? Where is the Japanese fleet? They kept wondering at that time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there is an incursion into Somalia's... Oh, Ceylon. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Are they trying to cross? No, they considered it. But I think Maywa is waiting for maybe bigger numbers. They have only 60k against what seems to be like a solid hundred and something. And the Indian land war, it looks like Serbia is trying to come up north through Shagatai, down through Persia. I believe Serbia only has half of their army here. Not sure. Oh, because they used to be able to walk through the main war, but they can't do that anymore now. Oh, they're going to try to eat the other side mm -hmm. of Maywar through Persia? Because Maywar has no... Tr oh, they have some troops. Actually, they have 120k on the home front. They are not defenseless, so it entirely depends on how many troops Nepal uh, or... Uh, no, Nepal is not in the war. Sorry, or are they? No, they are in the war. Depends on how many troops they or Serbia brings down. 
Meanwhile, in Borneo, it looks like Malacca has brought their entire army over, and I'm not sure, even with the combined forces of them and Brunei, if they can actually take on Japan. Yeah, that sounds difficult. They are split in two. And wait, why, why, why is the color just saying? No, they're still at war. They have brought everything they can. They know their home island are fine because their fleet is basically blocking any further incursion. But if they were to get invaded from the west, now that there are a few other nations, it could be very dangerous leaving their home front like that. Yes, yes, indeed. Uh, I guess we really all looking for ways to get their military better. Yeah, they started picking offensive ideas. Uh, it's going to take them some mana to be able to reach any good bonus. Because they're going to get, like, the first three bonuses are just going to give them peps to their future general. Uh, offensive will take a while. I mean, there is this 5% this discipline at the end, but that's, that's going to take a while. Serbia walked out of this war, Chad is saying. Let's see, did Serbia peace out? Serbia peace out. Like I'm, I'm done with this. I am done walking through like half the world just to fight against those people. Uh, which means Orisa is losing some allies at least. But they still have Mewar Nepal on their side. This is gonna be interesting. I, I think the the land front of India is probably secure now, because the only way into it is through Ceylon, and that's. They're probably yeah, they're waiting for them on those islands. They have put some coastal defense. It's going to take a while for someone to go through. Serbia seems to think that maybe some other wars are brewing the way that they are recruiting more troops and potentially mobilizing towards the North Scilly border. So maybe... Oh, another trouble something. brewing. And back in the Caribbean, the pirates have reigned supreme. They have beaten the American Navy and they had stuck it. The American Navy is now stuck in Cuba and they cannot leave port under threat of getting immediately murdered by an insane amount of ships. So they are tying each other down. And and I, I'm not sure America can make enough can do enough damage uh, with like most of their army stuck on Cuba. Crazy that America did not try to get access through Texas and instead take all of Cent they they went right for the they island when they don't have the naval superiority for that. I think it was not a bad move. I think it was probably a desperate call from uh, from Brunei saying like we need you to pull back and we need you to draw out the the pirate navy so we have a chance at beating Japan, which they did. To be fair, that allowed them to get naval supremacy back and send reinforcement to Brunei. But now they need to be, if they manage to beat uh, Japan out of Brunei, then Japan has nothing. They can't retreat out of those islands and they don't have the numbers to defend their home islands should someone decide to invade them. They would have to rebuild an entire army in Japan. They probably have, no, they don't have the manpower reserves to do that anymore. They would probably have to tap it. Oh, they don't have any uh, professionalism. So... Mercs is the only thing they might be able to uh, to raise if they need to defend the home islands. They can't raise any more troops if those troops in Brunei meet their end. Although I don't think this is going to happen because I think they are picking the battle correctly. And, and Japan just does not... Oh god, look at the morale difference though. Yeah, Japan has a way better uh, army quality, which means... It's going to be a cat and mouse game around Brunei for a while. Um, in South America, Jerusalem is also in this war, <laughs> South American Jerusalem. And oh. they are not actually actively fighting it, but they could go north into Gotland. Oh, and that could kind of sandwich Mexico. Yeah. Texas weirdly sitting out of this one for now and just waiting, figuring out what next to do. But yeah, I think... Oh, no, they have started, actually. They're just taking slow oh, time Texas? to... Uh, no, not sorry. Oh. Uh, they are in Caramarca, in Peru, uh, Jerusalem, trying oh, okay. to start sieging some mountain forts, which... Actually, Gotland has nothing around it. It's going to be a long trail around the Andes all the way to Panama, but, but there is not much standing in the way because oh, Gotland has split his in two now, trying to... Get enough boats, keep enough boats around to to get the to 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 get the American Navy stuck there, and I guess then try to move the rest somewhere else to go back and help. Uh, I don't see them crossing anytime soon. Now let's look at their navies because they did split in two. Yeah, they have a second fleet. That where are they going? A uh, big battle in Borneo right now. Japan and oh. Brunei. Oh, Brunei just lost. Oops, That's I almost saw them. 
That's uh, not looking too good. Brunei, of course, very low, zero manpower. You had mentioned this before. I think they're out of professionalism. They sure are. Their homeland is burning. There's Mercs are their only hope. They're currently losing 130 oh God, yeah, ducats a their month. Money is, uh, their money is burning. Oh let, me, no. let me switch there. Very spicy for the Spice Islands right now. <laughs> And Korea has managed to retake naval supremacy somehow. I guess they took a beating in one of the naval battles. Oh, Persia is in a war right now oh. against the Papal State. Oh. Ooh. Oh, oh, Serbia. The Kingdom of God, allied with France, have declared a war against Serbia. Oh, boy. Which... If they don't get more allies, that's going to be tough for them because they did not involve Great Britain. And that's Serbia, Persia, Romania, and Russia against them. I don't know how they hope to win those numbers. I guess Persia did not see that one coming. They had no one on the border. Yeah, they did not see that one coming. They clearly were busy somewhere else and did not expect the papal troops to start pouring in. I can see a bunch of people have stopped, like Sealy has stopped, uh, have stopped drilling the troops now. Uh, I don't know exactly what they're doing with them, but yeah, the Sealian troops are just sitting by the border. They have, they have broken the, they have a truce with Serbia. I guess they declined the call to arms, because they, yeah, they have a very fresh truce with Serbia. Uh, Westphalia doesn't look like they're mobilizing. Uh, oh, we've got a pause. I wonder if that's the um, Malacca peace deal. I wonder. What exactly? I mean, can Orisa ask for anything at this point? Because again, Brunei is a junior partner. They still need to get down to Malacca if they really want that Wasco ticking as Japan. Could be that um, all of the allies just want out. This is. Oh. 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 Uh, no. No. That no. Was not it. I, okay. I don't know what it was, but it wasn't that. Unless the U.S. worked. No, the U.S. is still in the war. Oh, and now the entire eastern seaboard is being blockaded by, oh, by no. pirates. They're probably going to go for the good old like economic argument. I think they need to pull in Texas and ask Texas to just murder Mexico. Because now they're stuck on Cuba. And they kind of, I guess, turn into the Bay of Pigs in some weird turn of events. Because <laughs> they cannot do anything with all their army stuck there. Um, yeah. Uh, I mean, they are getting some respite from... Uh, wait, no, it's. I thought it was Jerusalem, but no, it's Gotland, the particularist. We are technically <laughs> make, making more occupation than, than Jerusalem uh, themselves for now. There's Let's go back to Serbia. Has any battle? Oh, battle, yep, big, big battle, battle, big battle is happening. And Looks the Pope like has the numbers, but Romania is coming in the nick of time. The Pope has. Uh, the no, no, the Pope Romania. Has morale. It is not looking too great for their opposition. Yeah, they will need some time to mobilize because Persia is probably marching as we speak now. The numbers are against uh, Kingdom of God in France, but... I think their hope is to knock Serbia. Like, I, I mean, I, again, a repeat of history, but it sounds like someone is hoping to knock Serbia out of the war real quick. Uh, before Russia and, and their other allies will mobilize like someone tried in 1914. <laughs> and I don't know, how, like, they are making some early gains, but Russia, where is Russia? Is Russia mobilizing? Is Rush, Russia marching? Where is Russia, actually? Where is their army? I can't see it. Ooh, I don't know. Where is the Russian army? I, where are they? Oh. oh Yemen. Wait. Yemen is fine. Wait, wait. Russia has parked all the army in Siberia and stop paying them. What are they playing? Did they go bankrupt? What, what's happening? Maybe they feel like they don't need to intervene in this war and just uh, accept it so that they didn't break alliances, but probably there's some yeah. player diplomacy going on. This That's is, what I assume. A lot this of is, in dealing this is an thing. interesting play for Russia because if they mobilize, it's Prussia is coming. I respect Prussia for doing that. Prussia is bringing them... Uh, wait, actually, is that May War? That's Orisa and... Oh, wow. Wait. <laughs> are the Indians coming in? The Indians are not in that war. Why are they coming against it? I don't understand. Why are the Indians marching this way? That's a good question. Why when they are have they their marching? Own things to be yeah, dealing they, with. Their only enemy is like there's no one. 
Oh, and the U.S.? How? Did Gotland offer them to ferry them across the Atlantic? That's on, that's on, that's on, and why are they, go where are they going? <laughs> they have so many troops and, oh no, they're going for Africa. Oh, Because okay. Somalia is in the gang. And they're like, you know what? We'll walk all the way to Somalia if we have to. And Somalia has nothing. Well, they have 28k. That's nothing. All the troops are in Ceylon right now. To be fair, to do... Oh, no. Oh, they sneakily retreat in one province away from the the strait of, uh, of, um, of Ceylon, making them think that they had nobody. But they have 90k hiding behind Madura just in case... Uh, someone tries to cross. That's interesting. Now, Persia is arriving, meaning Serbia is starting to take a big... Uh, oh, they took a big battle that maybe they should not have taken. A flat field with no bonus. Reinforcements I, on the way. Yes, yes. Uh, oh, Persia marched in, but I don't know if they want to take it. Oh, oh there's going to be... A, oh, there's going to be... They're going to be caught in the middle, but... Yep. But but Persia is going to come. Oh, I think they might... Oh, Romania alone cannot win this, but Persia is coming in. Persia has demonstrated in the previous war that they are not to be trifled with. They do not fuck around. Uh, they Mamluks are mobilizing as well, but interesting to see that the Indians are... Yes, yeah, so they here. won the southern uh, reinforcement battle, but they lost the big top battle. Oof. Uh, ooh, ooh, this is this is getting a bit messy. They'll need a while to uh, to get all the troops in order and and figure out what to do. I think they will eventually. What? Oh, Russia started paying the troops again. Five discipline from Persia. Russia is starting to pay for their troops, but they are. Wait, they are all marching toward the. Ma oh. I think we're going to jump on Manchu. I think Russia is just going to jump on Manchu right now. And during this time, Westphalia, Great Britain, not intervening. Not yet. Not yet. How is it going on Brunei? Oh, Brunei is fully occupied. I think they managed to just kill everybody on the island finally. So now they're only holding back because they have Malacca and they can't really reach those islands. Uh, but they are minus 50%, meaning I think Japan could potentially stab at Malacca into getting something. They might not get a lot. Wait, did Malacca peace out? No. Malacca is in the Papal War and the Orissa War. But they're not in the Japanese War anymore. It's only Brunei, Jerusalem, Maine. Oh, they managed to... And Got Gotland is still in the fight. So Malacca peaced out with some of the war. They're still in... Wait, Westphalia has joined the Kingdom of oh, God now. No. Curious to see what Great Britain does. I think I think Russia is about to jump. Uh, yes, they are mobilizing an insane amount of troops at the uh, at the Manchu border. Uh, Manchu has nothing there because all the troops are tied down. I think Russia is just gonna do a play here and just say, you know what? I'm out of those wars. I'm just gonna jump the weakest neighbor in the meantime. If we go back to Europe, the Pope has been pushed back. I think finally uh, Persia plus Serbia has shown again that if they uh, if they all like gather together, they can send uh, the, 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 the kingdom of God packing. And I think they did, even without Russia. Livonia is still sitting this one out, not even paying for their own troops. Same for Great Britain. Westphalia, though, has decided to enter the fray. Uh, so that's that's Austria Hungary calling on <laughs> on the Germans <laughs> because they can't beat Serbia. I've seen that one before. Um, let's. Mamluks let's are marching north, but they have a very small army, but still every little bit counts. Yeah, which 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 way are they gonna go? Oh yeah, because there is like Somalia. Is Somalia pieced out now? No. No. Because. No, okay, it's gonna be a while for Orissa and friends to uh, to push down stuff. Nepal as is still in the same war, and I guess we're mostly focused on uh, on also kicking Zimbabwe out and also taking some colonies. I think Brunei is in a really bad spot now because they they are the main target and. And, and they do not have the option. Yeah, they 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 are gonna get murdered by. They them. are burning. Yeah. Yeah, and they are burning. Uh, unless they can stop people from reaching like uh, uh, what is it, uh, Sulawesi, uh, and and the other islands, they 
are still going to get a, a hefty war score. Somebody's asking about Gotland. Gotland is... Uh, Being Gotland is down by Jerusalem, who is marching north. Oh, yeah, they are pushing. And they are bringing... No, there's no troops there. But they are bleeding the Americans uh, pretty hard, I think, with their... How is the uh, American war exhaustion going in this war? America is seemingly coming mm -hmm. down towards Texas. I wonder if they have gotten... Uh, Access and if I think they're building, if they might be building new troop in Te Texas still sitting that one out. Uh, they are still not in the best shape. They are a bit behind 15 military techies. I mean, it's not bad for that era, but everybody who's serious about this game has pushed more. The problem is America is stuck on Cuba. The main American troops are stuck in Cuba and cannot get out. There's they are also there building ships that are stuck in <laughs> at port because they can't. Yeah, take they can't, them to consolidate. They can't beat those guys out. Uh, and they might need to make a break for it. But that's going to be difficult because the pirates have the number. Uh, maybe you can petition Great Britain to be the kingmaker and just bring their fleet in. Although Great Britain fleet has not demonstrated as much firepower as people could expect from Great Britain. Uh, they do have... Uh, a, a, a sizable, they should have a sizable big navy. That's not even that big. They have 20 heavies and another 20 heavies in another fleet. That's not... But if we compare naval morale, Great Britain is... Oh, they have insane yeah, bonuses. Yeah, it's disgusting. Like, it, it is disgusting, I indeed. And Scilly is not in the war, so they're like a neutral partner in between those two. Well, after they uh, backstabbed the Pope, I was very curious to see that they weren't they had no consequences from that. They, they've actually been able to grow. I was very concerned about uh, what was going to happen with Silly, but oh, they've uh, made some good alliances. And so. it has happened. Russia has jumped Manchu as a, a, in, in a big backstabby move. Oof. Uh, and they're just pouring down like every Russian they got uh, in Manchu. I don't think Manchu can come back from that one. No, especially with most of their troops uh, elsewhere. Because if they can't even push down all the way to Korea, they can't reach the Japan home islands, but they might not need to. So I guess Japan is really in a hurry now to peace out Brunei if they can just just get those Philippines as as the as the as the mean Japanese they are, but also I guess Korea is gonna want some of it too. Get something out of this and then we focus their uh, the fights. Manchu's army is stuck in Japan as well as on Borneo, and I don't think that there is any way that they're going oh to yeah, be able Brunei, to... Oh, yeah, Brunei has managed to <laughs> sneakily <laughs> dunk on the islands, but I think it's too little too late. Uh, those 10 Ks are not going to be able to uh, to stop Japan. Uh, and Korea is uh, hastily like bringing up an, an, a small army there because Russia Russia is going to, as soon as the forts fall... Actually, they're taking their, one, their sweet time. I'm just going to uh, let chat know um, there are panels beneath the stream if you would like to see the list of rules, the players, which players are playing which nations, and you can also do uh, exclamation point grandest land command in order to see all of that. And yes, Yemen has formed um, oh, from Hasa, yeah. so they are not currently in any war, but they are allied to Persia, Somalia, and Malacca. And Somalia has been losing their early forts in the Upper Nile, which is kind of a dev valley of like free development and desert. Uh, and they are waiting for a good battle. Oh, and I think we might see one now because they have pushed toward uh, Damot and uh, those uh, Ethiopian mountains and, uh, and highlands. And now what are they going to do? They have the numbers. Are they going to try to jump on Anu and uh, Damot and try to get this? Yeah, they are. They are. They, they, have, they got them on that, uh, on that place. And now they're going for it. They're like They are stuck here. They cannot reinforce fast. They might be able to reinforce if they see it coming. But if they don't... Okay, their troops are... No, their troops are actually... Let's see. Somalia had great generals the last time we saw them. And they... Their morale is not as good, but they have the discipline. Uh, and the general is not as good as he used to be. Uh, but if they can quickly knock this one out of the bag, which they might be able to because those, 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 those provinces are far away from each other. They have to walk a long way. I think they're going to beat them. Yes, they yeah, beat them. And then the, the other ones are movement locked in. Oh, no. Which means they're going to have to just run on them and get slaughtered on their own terms. Oh no, Arisa oh. backed off. They knew there was Yeah, no and Nepal is just left alone like, oh, oh god, and they died. Oh wow, F for uh, Nepal. 
Famlux just sitting at the border menacingly. They are actually out of that war. Mm. They have also pieced out of all three of their wars. Okay. Okay, now we see like the French and the, the, the Popes have gathered another l big group of troops There's in Sicily, waiting for a p where are they going to attack next. Yeah, I think everybody's wondering where are they going to push next. Obviously, they're probably going to try to go through uh, Carpe, like Transdanubia and Slavonia, which is a way flatter terrain than trying to risk a battle on one of those terrible like Serbian oh, mountains. Oh, and they're going in. And they're going in in force, actually, because wow. a sieging group. And it's the problem when you start getting those battles. Like, do you still commit everything you got, or do you like, you know what? And I'm Persia, gonna, I'm gonna let those guys die. Yep, Persia is just sitting on the coast to stop uh, the Kingdom of God from landing. But honestly, their troops could make or break yeah. this battle. Uh, what do we got here? We got a five-six-three-three general against a six-four-three-three general. Those are pretty good generals on both sides. Uh, the, oh, France is coming up. Oh. France has, has 120k reserve to throw at it. Uh, let's see, how's the front line looking like right now? We have we have some reserves on both sides, and France can throw a bunch. But I guess Persia could march in. No, they're not marching in. Oh, they, ah, they are marching in now, but that's going to be too little it too late. It might be too late. They are forced marching. Can they hold? Can they hold? They do still have 24,000 on the first row. They can Two hold. More days. They can hold. They can hold, uh, I think. They are holding. And they brought these reinforcements in the nick of time. A lot of Westphalians, though, coming Yeah, now in. Westphalia is going to try to do the exact same thing. Oh, very similar numbers. Very similar numbers. And they are running out of spare parts to uh, reinforce that battle because now the only remaining backup are Romania and they're not marching. But, but they are... No, oh, it's gonna be down to the wire. Oh, Pope, Pope has 30 more K. They're wondering if they should yeah. throw them in or not because those reinforcements are probably mostly cannon. Yeah, they're more cannon than man. Uh, okay, if they don't have any more reserves on, yep, no, nope. oh, oh, they, they got pushed back. They got pushed back. Yeah, I, I guess with uh, Westphalia throwing in the numbers too, they do have uh, enough. Did Russia piece out? No, they're still in the war, but they're just not doing much for now. That's that's a good battle for the poop. Did not start as a good battle. Um, but their reinforcements were very well timed. And then with yes. uh, France and Westphalia coming in, they were really able. At first, it did not look like they were mm. going to have that. But I guess they have a lot of... Uh, how many troops do they Yeah, they have. They don't have the numbers on paper, but you have to discount... 200,000 Russians that are basically not in the war. And if you f remove them, then they get back a pretty solid, hefty advantage. Because, yeah, again, that's you have to discount 200,000 Russians that are not actually going to... Speaking of Russia, they just sent Nepal packing down in uh, Manchu, uh, getting very close to Beijing, actually. And also, Kingdom of God and Westphalia are Miltec 18, and everyone else is Miltec 17, so Ooh. they have a small advantage on that. Yeah, how, how, how good is that one? I forgot what it gives you. Oh, it's better cannons, better combat width, and some flanking range. Okay, so yeah, it's, it's they get bigger cannons that, that go bang. Oof. Uh, pretty pretty high uh, compared to the previous ones. Some few pips. Oh, and now now they're looking at the mountains that guards the entry to Korea. Those are those are really good defensible terrain. North North Korea uh, is is defended by a really painful mountain range that Russia will have to go through. But if they do, then then it's GG for Korea because I don't think they can stop this. The question is: Is Brunei gonna keep them bleeding? And not surrender, because I guess... Oh, Japan has managed to land a crossing, and they are crossing to Sulawesi, because I guess the Brunei fleet in no, alone cannot stop Japan. With Malacca, they had the numbers, but without Malacca, I don't think they can. Back in Serbia, we've got a real big battle coming up again. It looks like uh, Persia uh, oh, is... Persia got a bit... Outnumbered, but there are reinforcements on the way. Should they fight this one, or should they take it... It's, it's, it's fight for Zagreb, right? It is Zagreb. It is Flatland. The Pope has minus one for the crossing. Uh, Persia 
thought that they were going to be able to intervene with the reinforcements, but they are just getting slaughtered oh, up there. Oh, yeah, in yeah, that's, that's a two-pronged battle. Oh, they should probably take their losses and back up before they lose more. But oh, no, Serbia's going because in. because they looked at backs, backs. someone mm -hmm. made a move alone on backs, and maybe they're hoping to wipe them fast enough before they can be reinforced. But 30k with Falions are coming down. And I think they can't, they, they're going to damage them pretty hard, but I don't think it's going to be enough, fast enough for them to not just pull everything they got. Uh, I think it was a, wi a good trial, but if they don't have the numbers, I think without Russia, yeah. And uh, oh, no, the Westphalian went packing. Interesting. I did not think this would happen. But I think that they were using that as a diversion to get the other fort down in uh, Zagreb, yes. which it looks like 35%. It, it's the problem, right? Like, the, the, the invaders clearly have the numbers, so they have to tie them down and concentrate their forces to get the decisive battle before it can be reinforced. Meanwhile, let's look at America and Gotland real quick. Uh, America is still building ships, but they cannot uh, get out of Cuba, still stuck there. Uh, Jerusalem slowly grinding up, although, where are they now? I've lost. I, I can't uh, see them anymore. They have 8k down. Oh no, they have pushed. They're all the way to Panama now. They have 2k uh, there. <laughs> which has oh. been renamed Scotland's <laughs> shame. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and and they are uh, they are slowly sieging Panama. Uh, I don't think they have a canal yet because they don't have the text by any margin uh, to get through. Uh, but eventually, I guess they will. Uh, be able to cross here, <laughs> but I'm not sure we'll see it in 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 that day. Uh, but going back real quick, Russia, Russia. Oh, Russia is making a move through those like dangerous forts. Uh, they have a few mountain forts they have to top down before topple down before they go. But Korea is not even trying to make a move. I think that's why probably Russia is being a bit cautious. They're wondering like how many troops are waiting on the other side. The answer is not many. <laughs> they should not be afraid. They should probably push for advantage. But first, they're like, I guess, sieging Beijing because it's a really good price to take with its 39 development. Yeah, Korea only has half their army oh. in their homeland, and but they are bringing 20k up. They are not going, going to... Going back to Serbia, another double battle around Zagreb and uh, and Varazdin. Uh, it is it is going to be tough. The numbers are not good. Oh god, Persia is retreating mm -hmm. on the wrong direction. No. Oh, well, oh no. Where are they going? Are they, are they, oh, they're retreating through neutral Sili and then they're going to get murdered on the mountain. Oh, oh this is going to be painful. Because they might have enough morale to order a retreat. I'm not sure. Uh, it, it, is, it, is. it is difficult. On the plus side, they tied forces up. So they might be able to win the south. Yes, they managed to retreat anyway. That's that's a good move for them, I guess. Because they tied up a hundred and something K while they won the battle south and, and, and lifted the siege of the grab. And oh, oh, exactly. oh, 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 they're going to... Uh, no, they don't have the numbers no. to wipe them. Because they have morale. Uh, that's that's bad for the Pope. Oh, no, they did. Oh, oh that was a huge oh wipe. Oh. oh, boy. The Pope just lost like 85 came in. That was a really good play from, from Serbia. Showing again and again that if you invade Serbia from that vector, it is not going to go well for you. People should have learned by now, but they don't. <laughs> Uh, looking quickly, Brunei is getting more and more occupied by the day. Uh, Malacca is just too busy fighting its old rebels to just do anything at this point. But Russia is slowly... Oh, God, that's... Oh, it's... Uh, it's um, They do not have naval superiority here. So they are taking a minus to not being able to blockade. And that's going to slow them down quite a bit. They, they need to bring more firepower. I guess they should just click the magic button and blow those walls. Oh, they have... Uh, no, they have not breached the walls. I guess they're not in a rush. They're like, eh, you know what, Manchu, we're winning on this one. I already have, like, a lot of war score on this one. I can I can sit on this. Yeah, Korea trapped down uh, Shagatai coast, and as soon as Beijing falls, that's the army. Yeah. That's half the army right there. <laughs> And then we can just slowly start walking down. Like there, there's, a, there's a, there, there, it is fortress Korea, right? There is like a, mil there's this, there's this mountain range that is, I, I, I usually try to keep the, um, Serbia. the impassable terrain in neutral color because it's hard to tell. But yeah, there is this, like walk of death through like f 
three mountain falls to go down Korea on that route. They might just skip it and just try to go from Pyongyang and then continue south. I would Big battle do in that. Italy right now. Friuli, it looked like Serbia was trying to take the offensive. And oh, let's see how that's going. Oh, they might have a shot, actually. Oh. Oh. No, I think they do. They do because, look, they have, they have like 100k reinforcement waiting there. Westphalia is uh, trapped up north. Yeah, and yeah. Uh, Persia, Persia taking the brunt of this on a mountain just to stop reinforcements from uh, helping out. A uh, pretty, pretty dangerous, but also solid because they are holding the ground. They are holding the ground on the mountain, uh, despite this, despite the odd. But that's uh, that's that's that was not enough. And now the reinforcements are gonna come. Oh, is but just in the Ooh. nick of time, the oh no, oh, Serbia no. just retreated. Yep, yep, they retreated. They're like, okay, this is this is not not today. They're trying to buy the Pope some time to make more units, but manpower for a Kingdom of God is actually still very good. Same with France as well. Yeah, and it's interesting to see that both Livonia and Great Britain are just sitting this one out and having fun watching uh, watching people just die for their amusement. Silly is still not taking part in the battles. It's Dito for Switzerland. Let's go back again to see how is it. Okay, so Brunei, Brunei is getting more and more occupied by the minute. Uh, Russia desperately trying to get those sieges. They are taking a lot of time to be sieged. It is, is it a level six fort now? It's still a level four, but that artillery is just getting unlucky. And 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 they're not willing to just burn the man out. I, I guess they just mm, can, they think they can wait this one out. I mean, it is their own war after all, and the war score is ticking on us. Oh, and they got a battle because Nepal came to help, and oh. oh, and they brought everything they got on this one. Oh, that's a lot of numbers. And Russia did not see that one coming. They took Beijing, but then they tried to push into Shagatai. And that was their demise. Uh, and and are they gonna abandon that siege? Yeah, they are lifting the siege. Like you know what? Fuck this. I, <laughs> I'm gonna regroup. I'm gonna regroup and try to beat the uh, Nepalese, uh, Japanese, and Korean uh, coalition army. And then we're gonna have uh, a, a, a nice discussion. They are not. I think they had time. They had time because they have some forts on the way. They could have probably continued that siege, but. I guess they don't know that Korea has nothing on the Korean Peninsula proper and is entirely relying on their forts. Like, there is nothing stopping troops. Like, forts, I mean, that's why forts are there, right? They're there to, to delay the enemy. Actually, that is the uh, war goal of the Russian <laughs> conflict is the... Uh, All the way up north. Assault for big fort. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think Russia can just sit on that one. How much do they got so far? They got 26% only. Uh, they, they <laughs> goal is take big fort. I mean, that was <laughs> that's a noble goal, and yeah. they got it. They got the big fort. I'm gonna <laughs> give that to them. And we're about to get more trade ideas. Let's go back to um, Serbia. Still going back here to League Verun. They technically are winning because again they have the war goal. The war goal is Rijeka, which is a flatland province that is not even a fort. Um, so they can probably wait a bunch uh, before that happen. And let's see. Pope still has 100k manpower. Westphalia, 200k manpower. France, France has burnt all they had. Yep. Surprisingly, France manpower pool is not as big as uh, as the other gangs. And they've lost a lot of professionalism as yeah. well, but they still have some. Bursha is still sitting on a lion's share of ha lion uh, of 231k of manpower. They they can do that for days. Do you want to show the ledger, and we can just take a look at um, military comparisons? Yes. Uh, army compar uh, army quality for us. So the kingdom of God has surpassed France in morale. That's the disgrace. They actually have really good stats. Almost seven morale, one twenty percent discipline. Uh, the professionalism is just gone, though. They they have none. They still have a good tradition. France has some professionalism they can tap into if they need to. Serbia sitting on a hundred percent professionalism, not willing to burn it yet. Uh, they really like those cool bonuses you get. Russia still like. We still have a bunch of really solid nations. Russia is not even in the top, but they still have. 135 discipline. Yeah, like they have discipline that can even make uh, put Livonia to shame at this point by by a mile. I guess they could start farming absolutism. Serbia if they wanted also 49% siege ability, which Russia, I bet, wish that they had when they were in Korea and Manchu. Yes. On the other hand, Switzerland has 50% defensiveness. Good luck taking those mountains. 
Uh, and Livonia has 40%. They, they will hold out. But yeah, the one that really wants stability right now is Russia <laughs> to get through those uh, Korean forts. Uh, but yeah, Persia's discipline, amazing. Uh, Westphalia, a good mention. May one, Nepal. Those Indians are showing everybody how it's done. Although Orissa has just stopped paying for the troops. They're like, you know what? I think they're just running out of money. Yeah, and uh, currently Westphalia, great power number two in terms of development right behind Great Britain. Mams somehow number three, but we haven't really seen, now that they own most of North and West Africa, not too much Mamluk expansion. We have seen several Mamluk stack wipes, so... Indeed. And I just see that the Ma Somalia has managed to piece out uh, Maywar, and I'm not... I don't think they gave away anything. Uh, let's see. No, that looks like a flat five of your true, so I think they just got a white piece out. I don't know. Maywar is not in a war anymore. Orissa... Orissa is still in the war. They're just one, one view. One. They're going back to the original staring context yeah. with Malacca. And they have not even recovered all their sieges in, uh, in, in Singapore yet. Because they, they don't have any money. They should have built more ships at this point. I mean, you know, you have a 25-year-long war where you can't cross a strait. And that's what's stopping you. I, I guess mean, they're getting called for peace. And they have 66%. They could just tab hit. Yeah. Uh, Malacca. Now, are they going to do it? Or are they like... Russia-Manchu right now is two-prong battle. Oh, oh, yep. Let's let's Shakhtai. have a look. Oh, so do that... Oh, and those battles are looking good for Russia on both sides, if they reinforce correct. Oh, yeah. They just murdered Chagatai mm. on one hand. And then they just do that jump on Nepali's reinforcements. Yep, trying they to run away from Jinnah, but can't run fast enough. Those Russians really making a uh, doing some serious damage here they're just they're just, being they're just wiping right nepal yeah. they're just wiping the floor with nepal it is amazing and nepal even with i think the higher oh. discipline just and they're not stopping they're like no <gasps> nepal i'm going to i'm going to push you to the end of the world like yep. they cross shagatai they're willing to run after them all the way into what is it north henan they're like, no, I don't care. You can't run away from me. I'm going to catch you and I'm going to piecemeal you one by one. Which is, I mean, it is a good play, right? Because they can't, those numbers are bad. Russia he wants to force battles and just wipe some stacks. Uh, they can always go for Korea later. And and they will. Oh, 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 Russia did not win that one by a huge margin. But they did win. And, you know. At the end, that's that's what it, what's counting. Yeah, it doesn't have to be pretty as long as you walk away from yeah. it. Oh, and the Woggle has been uh, uh, brought back again. Serbia is now ticking down score uh, for a new, a new time because Rijek has been occupied another time. Uh, Russia has peaced out, I'm told. Did Russia peace out? Yes, they did. They probably got what they wanted from Manchu, which is they got Big Fort. They got Big Fort. That's... That land doesn't look super exciting. What, what's the development? Uh, that's not super exciting. Five. But, 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 that's, but that's it is land. a coal province. Maybe that's why. Yeah. Maybe that's what they're going yeah, for. Maybe they, they, I don't know. Let's check uh, if we look at the history of Russia and we go at the bottom. They did actually get a lot of provinces. They went for the estuary, so it could have be it could be that they're trying to push further into the trade node. Yeah, yeah, I think they they probably are, and yeah, they just took a chunk of Manchu and uh, and and call it. Now the question is, are they gonna turn around? Are they gonna come and say, I'm gonna honor my alliance with Serbia now, and I'm gonna march all the way and and show the kingdom of God how it's done? Let's see. Those troops are not ordered that direction. Where are they? they are far away, though. Where are they being ordered to? They are only being ordered back to the border. They have not stepped out of the war. They could have pissed out a while ago, but they did not. Um, so what are they going to do? Are they still going to turn around? It's going to take them a while to march all the way down south to Serbia, but, I mean, by now, they could have just white pissed out, right? Like, if I look at them, they could... Uh, I could just go to the Pope and say, yeah, white peace, nobody loses anything. It's been it's been long enough. We can just chill. 
in Central America, looks like the U.S. has brought Mexico, I mean, I'm sorry, Texas into Mexico. Oh, yeah, and rebels are breaking Scotland the country apart. is currently being sandwiched into nothing. They have the naval supremacy, but it does not seem to matter now that they... Yes, it doesn't matter if you lose Mexico. Yeah. And even the capital is under siege by particularists, <laughs> oh, which, no. as we all well know, they want nothing in particular. <laughs> Oh it's no. it's still <laughs> it's <laughs> oh still a God, joke that we're like why are they called particulars? It's because they want nothing in particular. They just you know they're not they're not like uh, uh, they don't want freedom. They don't want uh, they just uh, they're just upset in general. Yeah. Like I guess the French. <laughs> you know, we just we, we just we just get pissed and strike for reason. Although we do have usually a good reason. Brunei is still not pissing out <laughs> s because uh, I guess oh because how much devastation can they handle? They can handle some because again, Jerusalem. Because again, like Texas and the U.S. are beating up Gotland, and I, I, I guess they hope that if they can peace out Gotland, then the American Navy might be able to try something. I don't think the American Navy can beat Japan right now. This is, this is not. Oh, big battle going on in Mexico. Oh, Gotland is getting. Oh, trounced. Brazil. Brazil has as 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 sent out troops to uh, to Jerusalem. Nope, got trounced. Uh, and yeah, Gotland, those pirates, uh, they like they need to be uh, s on on a boat. Like their 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 sea legs are good, but their land legs are like very wobbly. <laughs> <laughs> and I mean, Texas stands to gain a lot actually, because they got kicked out of those at, of this area of Mexico early on. But if they can get it back, like again, this state, I don't know how much Gotland developed it. But it is five gold mines. They have not developed it a lot, actually. They did develop it a bit. And again, this is this is this is five gold mines right there. Yeah. That is money. Curious that Gotland didn't dev it, considering they've been in Central America for quite some time. Yeah, I I, I guess they have so much stuff. Like the problem, I mean the problem. It's it's a good problem to have. But the problem you usually run into into this land is that you want to develop everything because the trade goods are insane. Like you have cocoa everywhere you have spices you have so many gold holy shit so much gold sugar spices like you, there's just like, you you have you have good resources for days yeah money to be made exactly and we are seeing a standoff in the papal conflict ah. it i think they are waiting for and i just heard a peace deal being yep. refused uh i think gotland got an offer and they said no or the other way around Let's go back to Serbia. Yeah, there is a standoff. They need to take the war goal back, but they're not willing to come in. Are they waiting for Russia? Is wait, why are they all there? Oh, Serbia standing around the boss for us. What is happening? Do we have another front? No, they don't. Or why? Persia is going home. Yeah, Orissa, by the way, has pieced out of that war. So the only Asian conflict right now is the Brunei Japanese one. Oh. And it doesn't seem like Brunei has uh, availability to come back. No, it's all going to be like Texas and the United States really trying to ex enact, ex extract something from Gotland. So it's the question of who gives up first. I guess the US and Texas will be pissed if, if Brunei surrenders to Japan because they just have done that for nothing. But also, Brunei has been burning for a while. I guess the only thing saving them is that it's a lot of really small islands to take if you want to fully occupy them. Yeah. And rebels are already trying to free up the Philippines left and right. Oh, and Brunei is risking a disaster now. Uh, rebels are not going to break the country anytime soon, but yeah, they are going to go into internal conflicts. And did Orisa actually got what they wanted? Uh, no, they didn't get the war goal, but I believe that they did get the this province wow. here. Wow, that's, <laughs> that's, that's 40 years of war Pachaburi. for not much. <laughs> I guess that's that's something. Yeah, their war goal was Chaya, and it seems that they did not obtain that. Mm, so Serbia is, or is... Did France peace out? No, but they went home. France went home. They're not even bothering covering the front lines. Only the Pope and Westphalia against only Serbia, because... Why is Persia going home? Are they tired? This could or have do they have a another player diplo like diplomacy where they decided, hey, look... 2v2 me bro, two or, two or me bro. actually 1v1 because because again it's just Serbia it's just Serbia alone yeah but France is still there yes but they're not really doing anything they're staying in France proper just chilling they're not they're not 
go oh, oh this started actually they started drilling yeah and that's okay. a clear sign of like you know what i'm uh right. you have fun yep. you have so. fun i just don't want to i don't, I don't want to do this but why is persia going home because they have not peaced out they have not peaced out they're just they're just not there oh i have an idea maybe i don't know they're still missing one sites for their religion uh which would allow them to pick one last bonus i guess i guess they have the ritual they really wanted at this point. And Russia, who is not concerned at all in this conflict. <laughs> no, they stopped paying the troops again. Yep. And Romania also seemed to have gone home. Or, yeah, it's only Serbia and, and the Pope now. Although, I can see that, uh, yeah, Westphalia is still sitting behind. So maybe they'll have a... Maybe they... Oh, no. Uh, no, they're still there, I guess. Maybe they made a, a deal... Uh, and maybe the Pope and Serbia can fight this one out. I'm not I don't sure. see why Silly is not getting involved because if Papal State is trying to hop a few provinces over, don't they realize it's probably going to be their Austrian coastline that's next? Yeah, it's 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 bizarre. Persia has gone home now, and they're just drilling in uh in 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 Baghdad and around, like just just counting, doing nothing. Interesting. Do we think this war is gonna go nowhere? And we're just like, you know what? It's just, just a Pope. Tell me when you're tired. I, I, <laughs> I don't want to fight this one anymore. It's Westphalia seems to be there back in the Pope. Yes, up, they all the ones staying around, considering, uh, considering keeping up. The other ones are gone. What about Gotland? Oh, Gotland is just burning now. Yeah. Gotland is on fire. America is just oh, we could even get the troops. Gotland fleet has mm, no they. They stopped the big siege. They the stopped the big siege now. They're just um, in Brunei right now. All of the occupied lands are being taken back by rebels, which could be a good <laughs> thing for their war score. I guess this is this is better. Was <laughs> yeah, because yeah, they they yeah. they might duck under. Uh, and uh, yeah, they've ducked down under forty percent. So stab heads is not on the menu anymore. Yeah. They might be waiting for the American conflict to resolve before. They decide where this is gonna go. Oh, good point, Chad. You know, Gotland has zero sailors left, so their navy is oh. actually suffering. Yeah, because right now. you need land to feed those those uh, those pirates. Yeah. Uh, and they have a deficit of sailor actually every month right now. They need nine thousand sailors to reinforce, and they have none. And they're running out of land that is not occupied by either rebels or Jerusalem or Texas or America. It looks like. Um, the Americans have already partitioned what they want from Gotland in this war. Jerusalem coming up and taking uh, Panama. Texas oh. coming down and taking Mexico. <laughs> I United respect States America for like, I want Panama. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yep. Uh, so. this, is, this is, okay, we want Panama. It is ours. Uh, yeah, I think Gotland is about to get a peace deal and they're going to have to take it. Uh, but if they need Brunei to send that, I guess, because none of them is a major partner. Yep. So I guess Brunei is going to try to make over just to Gotland and say, hey, give us this. The and, Pope and is moving in on Serbia. Oh, let's have a look. And it is looking like none of their allies are joining, not even Westphalia. So this might actually This might be a 1v1. 1v1. Uh, the numbers look like they're on the side of Serbia, unless the Pope has more reinforcements behind it. Do not they have, have 60k, but they don't seem to be moving them. No. Oh, oh. So it's just numbers versus skill. Serbia has a magic global defender dice roll bonus, which I never remember what that is, but they have it. Oh, I think it's from one of the defensive ideas, maybe? I oh, forgot what it, that, that is. That extra 60k is on the move. Kingdom of God with the discipline and morale advantage, but if they're not going to make it in time. There's make too many provinces. Time. And there yep, we there go. They, they got sent back in again. And and Serbia is going after them. I mean, they Serbia is hurting in manpower, though. Uh, they are at full professionalism. And they do not want to lose it because of that 50% uh, general cost and 100%. Uh, yeah, I, I, I get why they don't want to drop it. They... To be fair, the or gaining oh they're only gaining three k a month. They're taking more loss than that. But the Pope is being pursued. And yep. holy shit, the stacks are being murdered. Yeah, and ooh, they are protected by Venice. This is this is this is the, 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 the chance that surviving is because they can retreat on Venice. Although Venice is a really dangerous retreat because if they cannot get out of no, they're, they're running away. Getting stuck on Venice is really bad for you if the enemy is sieging Treviso. Yep. But yeah, Treviso being a hill fort, obviously never a good spot to be stuck at. 
Yeah, I think that they have just diplomatically decided this is going to be a 1v1 between I, I, I Serbia and that. Papal States. I respect that. no one else is... I mean, they haven't peaced out. I'm curious why there isn't a... Yeah, why are the allies still in the in the? Are they like just staying there in case some someone decides? Like maybe if they don't trust each other's side to be like, hey, what if you peace out and then I don't? Yeah. Because yeah. I mean, if you are a bit cheeky, you say, yeah, sure, you peace out, we peace out later, and they're like, actually, we not, and now we're just gonna <laughs> steamroll the Pope, and you have a truce. Serbia bringing in their navy, but I don't. I actually think that. Let me double check before I make this up. I think that Kingdom of God actually has naval supremacy. They have uh, oh, 82 galleys. Are they going to fight Serbia? I mean, because Serbia, you were mentioning earlier, or someone was mentioning earlier, that if you were Serbia, you would go for those boats. Uh, and Serbia has. Have they gone for the boaties? They do. Oh, they have they have six. No, that's the number of cannons, not the number they got. No, no. They Serbia does not have the numbers yeah. to contest the Pope on the sea, but they have taken Treviso now. The next step is gonna hurt because that's Trent, that's uh, Trentino, and that is uh, really painful forts to siege in the mountains. They do have the numbers on their side, and they're still managing to turn a profit despite being widely over false limit. Oh, Jerusalem has uh, pieced out of their war. Have they gotten anything? I think so, yes. Look at, like, Gotland looks yep. weird. I think they have... Yep, they've taken... They are pushing more north. Uh, few of these provinces, for yeah, sure. Yeah, they don't have cause on those yet. One, two, three, four, five provinces, I believe. Yeah, I yeah. did not realize that Andalusia was in Colombia. Very curious predicament for them to be in. They have taken their little Castilian vassal, but France is pushing down into Andalusia. I don't feel safe for Andalusia. They have been split. Now the question is, uh, yeah, if, 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 if Texas and, and the U.S. want uh, their demand and force, they have to peace out with Japan, which still keeps Scotland in the war. Burning, but it keeps them in the war. If it, so that, that, that's the question. What do they want more? Do they want to solidify it again? Because to be fair, the problem with Gotland now is that they just got a separate peace deal. They can still, like, the rest that they got can still be occupied and is being actually occupied by a mix of rebels and other troops. So, uh, this is, oh, oh, Gotland has managed to bring up, like, 36, uh, 38k uh, troops here to contest, like, a bunch of <laughs> running uh, Texans. But I think it's going to be until, yeah, until they see them and now they saw them and now they're going to run after them. And I don't think this fight is going to go well uh, if you fight to fight the U.S. Oh, the, the U.S. has managed to muster like almost 80k. Yeah. Uh, this is not going to go. Oh, oh, and uh -oh. the battle is about to happen. Ooh. And it's not going to be a great uh, battle for the GOATs. Let's see. Uh, I mean, America's troops are actually worse than God. Yeah. <laughs> they have less discipline. Wow, go go for it, America. But Texas might be coming and saving the day with us. Oh, God, the general's a monster, though. Yeah. Guillermo Manrique de Velasco, a very Texan name, proper Texan name, 6544. Four. That guy and 10% compatibility. That man has been itching. Texas gets a mission for a ridiculous general, I believe. It might be... Do they have missions now? I don't remember. Uh, what's their focus tree? Oh, uh, nope. No, they have the generic mission nope. tree. Never mind. But but I guess they don't need it. They just... They, just, they have... Usually, usually you have a huge army tradition, and that's just that. U.S. naval battle beating Gotland's fleet right oh, now. Oh, they took... They took a chance while Gotland was not looking. Yep. Uh, but the big Gotland fleet, no, they did not notice this. I think they're using the fact that, again, it's one player versus several, and you have to figure out everything, and especially boats. I mean, there is this This is why you can put your boats on an automatic, like, hunt down people and beat them up. Uh, looks like uh, Papal States has beaten Serbia. They Back. have retreated. They are retaking Treviso. They've landed yeah. this little 2K... On the islands. Let's see, where did they fight last? Uh, oh, they, 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 did, they tried to take Trentino on the mountain and yeah. lost. That is a difficult battle. And even with 50% extra, they did not manage to win. I'm assuming there's going to be a bunch of back and forth. Although, no, they both have manpower to, to, to spare. Uh, yeah. The Pope has more, actually. 
And yes, chat, Switzerland exists, and they exist as an, uh, they're basically, um, their murderers basically formed <laughs> Swabia, and then decided to reform them again. And oh, America still hunting the, uh, Gotland yeah, because I think Gotland is not looking at what's happening there. They have they a shit ton of boats, but oh, they're also, they have been damaged by just, not having like sailors. moving around and everything. Yep. Oh, yes. No oh, sailors. yeah, they can't repair mm -hmm. because they have no sailors. Gotland, you are hiding out right now. in a really bad situation. Yeah, yeah they have a hundred. They have been, uh, they're trying to burn down their war exhaustion, but it's just not going down. Oh, they should have stuck to their islands. That was originally Gotland's goal. They only wanted to take the islands and yeah. maintain naval supremacy. And and I, I, I guess they looked at Mexico and they're like, mm -hmm. mm, and they got greedy. Oh, they're trying to go anyway with like boats that are barely functioning. Ooh. Oh, what else can you do? I mean, you got to go down with the fight. Yeah, they have an insane moral advantage. Uh, America did not even bother bringing a pure. Oh, the pirate captains. <gasps> Oh they no. all mur. Oh, that was Texas. That was not America. Yeah. The American Navy ran away. The Texas Navy just. I don't think it exists anymore. It uh, is. It is gone. There is another. Uh, I've uh, seen chats. Uh, I think the American Navy is gone. In Italy. Right now, the fight for Treviso is back. Oh, let's go and take a look. And ooh, this is a tough fight. And Serbia, Serbia has the numbers, but they are already committed. And uh, no, nope. that was not good enough. Serbia is starting to hurt for manpower you now. You know, Serbia, though, has 100 professionalism versus Kingdom of God with zero. So even though Kingdom of God does have more manpower... If they're willing to burn their manpower, if they're willing to go there uh, and, and, and slacken professionalism, they will get a lot of troops back, indeed. Yep. Uh, but right now, they need 110k men to reinforce, meaning, like, do stacks could be a lot consolidated unless they decide to press the button. And I guess, yeah, they started. They're at 96 now. I think they realized that they need to start clicking the button and just get some dudes. Yeah. They, need they get 34 every time they click. They would need like to burn at least 20% to reinforce all their armies. They're going to have to do something, though, because Kingdom of God is moving forward to the Friuli Fort. And if they lose that... Their northern grassland forts are not going to defend them. They oh, oh it gone. just it's fell. Gone. Yeah. Oh, I, well. I guess that's why the poop did the poop bother upgrading. No, they're still level four forts. They're just not very solid. They don't last very long. Uh, meanwhile, Japan. Oh, Brunei pissed out. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, Brunei pissed out, and they. They didn't lose anything. I don't think they did. They've kept the Philippines, Korea. No, everything seems to be there. Uh, Korea uh, did take uh, Taiwan. It looks. Oh, I Texas has a few provinces that they have not called, so maybe they took something from Gotland. Let's see. Let's no, see. I'm not sure. Uh, let's see. All those provinces. No, that's a core. Oh, that one is a core of Gotland. No, they, they, they yep. took some stuff. Uh, did they Gotland take? gave two provinces, so I guess. Brunei took this. Uh, Japan surrendered? Is it considered a victory? I think it would be. Let me check the history of uh, of Japan, I guess. Because uh, that was Japan's war. Let's go down and see. Uh, unsuccessful Japanese conquest of, Sel of, of, of Keelung lasted for 11 years. Yeah. So, I am guessing that they basically sold Gotland out to just get out of this war and say, fuck it, we're not winning against Brunei right now. Back. Good, 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 good of Brunei. They stayed in the war all the time and they avoided taking any losses. Yep. They, they're probably not in a great shape right now. They, they, oh, they, they still got managed to get some manpower, but they are probably bankrupt. I just saw the stability gone away. Big battle uh, in Serbia. It looks back. like oh. Kingdom of God. Is they have the upper hand again, like a lot of the Serbian troops. Oh, no, Serbia has, has pressed the button now, uh, but they still need 130k men despite the gains they've made. And the Pope is just sitting with a lot of reinforcements waiting them back. This is this is not gonna work out for Serbia right now, and I they believe all losing on the number yep, side. Serbia's entire army there, so yeah, could be the tide. This is what changes the tide, and now. Kingdom of God has retaken war goal, so if they can push forward a few forts, then Serbia might not have time to recuperate. 
Yeah. Oh, and that that forced their fleet out yep. of uh, and, and they're, they're gonna die. Italy. So Chad is asking, did they pull a Johan? I don't know if it's technically we're allowed to call it a Johan, but yes, uh, it, starting a war, losing it, and then selling out your ally land to not lose anything yourself is technically called a Johan in the Death Clash universe. <laughs> uh, in reference to the creator of Europe Universalist, we used to do that a bunch, and then had trouble finding allies in the following Death Clashes. <laughs> Speaking of the devs, they are currently playing as Brazil. And conquering a bunch. Uh, or being conquered? They're being conquered. Oh, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> no. Who is killing them? <laughs> oh, no. South, South Frankfurt. Frankfurt. <laughs> Born and raised in South Frankfurt. <laughs> oh, no. Is that a Jerusalem <laughs> colony? Uh, are they a player? Are they getting beat up by AI? Oh, no. Uh, uh, where is South Frankfurt? S this... Tiny I don't I don't even find them on the map. How are they getting beat up? Oh, Wh no. What's happening? Yeah, they are. They have more numbers, though. Who is South Frankfurt? They are. Let's see. I want to see if they are a player. The issue is, is that my hotkeys are wrong. I can't These find. These are not oh. my hotkeys. Oh, South Frankfurt is in Montevideo. Okay, that's uh, that that, that okay, that's where they are. Uh, so the, their capital is occupied, actually. So I guess Brazil started this. Yeah, Brazil tried to take Montevideo, and I guess now Mapuche uh, and maybe other AIs have been... Okay, They might still be willing to manage to pull this one off, but... South Hold on, no, because Mapuche is coming down to, 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 to save them. I'm not sure Brazil has got this one in the bag, actually. They took the war goal, but they might not be able to keep it. Oh, no. This is a this is a, a sad day. Meanwhile, I guess the Serbian uh, the Serbian papal uh, conflict is still going on, and if Serbia wants to win this, they did not even burn that much professionalism, honestly. But Serbia, they still need seventy seven k men to come back. I think they need to back up behind their hills and mountain forts. I don't think that going in on the grasslands against the papal states right now is their wisest move. No, that's and I mean that's the thing when you're playing as the Balkans, right? Y if you can afford to lose some of that land, then you have like, if you're gonna have to go through like the the coastline, the Bosnian coastline, and then and then and then Kosovo, Albania. This is this is not a place you want to be fighting in. Uh, but if they are happy to just go for the Hungarian plains and everything around that, uh, well, technically Hungary is a bit more north, but it's some of Hungary and then Slavonia, uh, they are going to take a battle, though, and they are taking a battle in the fields of Zagreb again uh, with a 5-6-0-0 leader against a 5-5-4-4 leader. So maneuver on their side, although not giving them any special bonuses. Yeah, they are lagging behind in both morale and professionals uh, and, uh, and discipline. Sadly, the Pope has a solid advantage. Serbia, surprisingly, using a lot of cavalry, they have actually a lot of horses. I'm, 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 I'm surprised. They have an... Again, you don't see players pulling out cavalry in most of those uh, MP games. I don't think we're going to win this. The Pope has a lot of reinforcements they can send. Although and the Pope has a full back line. I mean, their their army composition seems to be a little bit more... Yeah, yeah. They have barely... Oh, wait. No, oh. their first rank is going down, okay, actually. Okay. This is, They're this also is rolling zeros, which... Yeah. You know, no, they have they've gotten some reinforcement now. They have 14,000, 12,000 on the first row. Not oh, no, there's still some reserves Serbia. on the Serbian side. Uh, but the reserves are, are melting now. 9,000, 8,000. Actually... This is... Oh, yeah. this was down to the wire. Nobody had anything left on the first row. But technically, Serbian lost that one. Why is Serbia relying so much on horses now? Uh, I did not expect that one coming. Oh, wait. They did espionage and divine? Is there a oh, aristocratic and espionage. I think there's a combo to get some. Uh, oh, Serbia actually has... Oh, yeah, these are the Serbian yeah. hussars. I uh, I think chat was just going to hate me for not <laughs> knowing uh, how, how Serbia or Serbian fights. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm used to modern Serbian fights, uh, which are a bit different and involve less horses. But, yeah, they do have some uh, pretty good modifiers on, on that one. Where is that one? Cavalry, 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 cavalry. They have a 65% uh, cavalry compatibility. That is... It's not yet like the numbers you would expect from... Uh, 
uh, from like a horde, but that's still pretty good compared to. Well, they also have some infantry bonuses. I'm assuming. Yeah, they have a, a, a mere ten percent, but sixty-five percent. Like their horses pack a punch. They are here to fight, and they have yeah free shot bibs. Uh, they they are here to say hi. Um, Russia has gone in on Shagatai. Oh, they, Russia's just mopping up people now. Yeah, during that war, I was actually watching their troop movement, and I was watching them go to the east, and I started checking their truces and saw that they were not truce to Shagatai. So Nepal? I, I am a little concerned right now. It is a Shagatai Nepal versus Russia. Russia has finally found their way as being the big bully we yep. would all uh, expect them Classic to be. Classic Russia. Classic <laughs> Russia. <laughs> Time to bully your neighbors for some <laughs> cheap land while everybody else is looking away. <laughs> Thank mm. you. Livonia. Livonia Blue Flame. What is oh, this? Oh. They are fighting Gotland. <gasps> oh this has finally happened. It's a Livonian crusade against we Gotland. Knew it. I've been waiting for this. After Gotland backstabbed the Livonia during that like 6v1, I knew that Livonia, yes. they had signed a what, 100 year pact of non aggression, I believe. And I, I said as soon as that was over, they were going to go in on Gotland. It took them much longer than that pact, actually. Well, especially since they did it without stopping to drill the troops. But yeah, Gotland now. <laughs> like, after are they, are they going to fight? They just, they just, they, oh no, they, they, they declared war without stopping drilling. I think that this is a diplomatic thing. They're probably going to peace out for that land. And Gotland knows that there's Nothing that they can do about it after being absolutely slaughtered Although in Central Gotland America. just called out Great Britain. Oh. Ooh, okay. Oh, okay. a lot of people just. Oh uh, no. Yeah, Great Britain. It, this is a fake war. This has to be. No one is uh, picking up troop maintenance. I don't think that this is actually a. This is some sort of diplomacy going on here. So this is something that is happening on the. Maybe because nobody's moving. Yeah, so that's maybe it's a mind. fake. Although, although. The, the 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 British fleet is actually moving in. Maybe Gotland forgot to tell people about that because they are moving in, uh, or, or 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 are they? No, they nope, came in and then they fucked off. I'm just like up. checking. Yep. Okay, I guess everything's <laughs> fine. Uh, Serbia battle again with oh. Kingdom of God, and it is looking oh, like. Oh, Serbia has the advantage this time. Yep. I think they pull all. They pull a lot of numbers immediately. Not willing to take a fight. They have inefficient cavalry support. Oh, no, they used to have inefficient cavalry support. Now they have the right numbers. They have a really strong shock there. They are dealing a lot of damage to the Pope. Oh, God, the damages are big on both sides. The Pope already down on cannons, though. Like, you can see their army is mostly cannons uh, on those numbers. I think they are losing that one pretty yeah. big. What happened? Well, they had lots of reserves. Uh, but Serbia just came back and caught them on a crossing, and that spelled murder for the Pope. Did That's they lose a stack, actually? Because where are the, the numbers gone? Uh, they only have 28,000 manpower left. I believe they're fully out of professionalism. They sure are. And so it looks like Serbia... Oh, and Serbia's going to run in person, yep. hoping... That, oh, God, they're all retreating, but where are they retreating? Oh, tell me... Uh-oh. Are they no, they are retreating okay. behind their force okay. to Venice, so they should be fine. Westphalia, though, uh, has st actually stopped drilling troops. Um, oh. They are paying maintenance, but they are not on the move, so we'll see what happens with yeah. that. Yeah, and Livonia... Livonia stopped drilling one of their stack because it doesn't have a general. Okay, that's still not... Oh, the peace? Oh. Yeah, they're not at war anymore. Oh, okay. Have they taken anything? I don't know. No, it does not look like it. Uh... Was Riga always owned by Gotland? No, if it gave land to Gotland, actually. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, okay. wait, 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 wait. Can they form something out of this? It must be maybe for Norse. Maybe it's to get Gotland. Gotland is already Norse. Oh, they're going to ask them to huh. to convert the land for them and then give it back so they cuz they can't be. get the they can't get the 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 the, 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 the Norse to cross the Baltic mm -hmm. and do the thing. So maybe that's that. Alan, what's their culture like? They're it could be something with their pirates. Maybe they're trying to give them ports, but they are... They can form a lot of things, but they're not interested. Oh, they have a decision to restore the Temple of Uppsala, which oh. I'm not sure what that is. Oh, yeah, they need Stockholm to be able to do that. Okay. So uh, I'm not Makes sure what sense. that even does, but... Ooh. 
Meanwhile, in Shagatai, looks like Russia has been dominating, but there is a battle going on right now. Let's see. Oh, oh yeah, but oh, that's that's more like a murder. Although, although uh, Shagatai has no, the horses have, are coming yep. in. The horse and it's a battle in the steps. Yep. So the horse should be able to show their uh, their firepower there. Uh, if they can, although Clip Shagatai Clark, is Russia. not a horde anymore, if I recall. Oh, are they not? I don't think they are anymore. Ooh, okay. Well, that changes some stuff. I'm not sure. Maybe they are, but I'm, I'm not 100%. East Shagatai is still a horde. See, they no, have they're, they're a proper sultanate wow, now. Okay. They, they got promoted. But Russia is not winning that one so mm -hmm. far. It's going to go down to they have about 24,000 people. Can they, they have make that? No. Uh, I think well? Shagatai no, is taking not. it on. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I think they got cocky. Uh, they tried to attack on too many fronts, thinking that they could just... <laughs> yeah, they are uh, getting this fort up here, though. So Shagatai did not attack on the mountain fort and instead defended their capital. Which, I mean, fair. Yeah. You want to defend your capital, but Losing yes. Losing a mountain fort is also pretty tragic. Oh, yeah, because that's, uh, that's, that's going to be a pain to take. I mean, it's only a level 2 fort, but still. Russia got rebel bombed. Not a problem for them. <laughs> Wait, Andalusia is at war. Oh. Andalusia. Oh, oh, Sili. Oh, no. Westphalia decided to attack Sili and Andalusia uh, because, I mean, I guess they assume that, that Sili does not have a lot of fire power in that game. That also means that there's going to be a weird no man's land between the Pope and, uh, yeah. and the other side. Battle can again on Friuli. Yes, it's about to happen. It is happening right now. And, I mean, obviously Serbia, he's eating the penalty for being on the defensive, giving the Pope a bonus, although their general is pretty good. And this time they all try to time their reinforcement. The Pope, the Pope does not have the number on this one. Uh, they still have the morale. They still have the discipline. So yeah, I guess someone has to win on the number side if they can't get the the bigger uh, the bigger modifiers. But oh god, the poop just threw forty five k of like, is that Mercs? Yes. Yeah. It's it's untrained Mercs and we're throwing them with barely any morale. Uh, at all, they I think they're hoping that the monthly tick. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's not gonna give them a lot of morale though. They're gonna have some morale, but that's that's not really what. A man would call morale. It's, oh, but we have another seven. K. I don't think seven K is gonna change it. Uh, the rolls. There is. There's still the like no, 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 no. no. That just that was too many very determined uh, Serbians in the fight. Meanwhile, Westphalia is just. Oh, I was gonna say there was team rolling, but. You know, man. here's the thing. Andalusia does not seem to be... Moving? Yeah, and I I think that the bulk of the Andalusian power is in their... But Sili has the number. Oh, they just hired a lot of mercs oh, now. Wow. And they're going to try to take a fight. It's not a bad fight to take, actually, because it's a minus one, and reinforcement might bring up a reaver crossing. Uh, but, oh, God, Sili's numbers are mm -hmm. not looking good in terms of military stats, though. The general is weaker. Mm -hmm. Uh, they are seeing their own king. Stefan von Sili is leading his troop from the front. Uh, that is that is admirable of him. Uh, stop throwing mercs without any morale, though. Uh, that's 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 not a good idea. You're just wasting body, if you ask me. Yeah, they should just pull out of this one. Was Australia in back. a golden era and having more manpower, less professionalism? I think. I think. That's not a good. Uh, that's the, those numbers do not look good for Silly. Let's no. let's be honest. Especially with the reluctance of Andalusia to join the fray, they are. Oh yeah, Andalusia is just sitting there, not paying the yeah. troops. Serbia now is is gotten lucky with the rolls, but is slowly pushing on Friuli. Well, Persia is at war. Persia is at war with. Oh wait, oh, no, sorry, yeah, they're still the same the war. They still conflict. they have not pieced out. They're still like. We'll just want to make sure it does not escalate. Yeah, things Russia? must be tense diplomatically because yeah. for all of these nations to not be piecing out but continue it as a 1v1, I wonder mm. what they're attempting to do. Yeah, the Pope is running low on manpower, though. They do not have any more professionalism to sacrifice and they only have 3k in the bank. Kingdom of God is... 
They need, hurting. They only need 22,000 to reinforce their stacks, and their stacks are better, but still. And they are about to embrace global trade. Oh, yeah, manufact no, manufacturers will still take a while to pop up. Going uh, back to the Shagatai-Russia uh, conflict, it looks like Russia is moving forward, but... Yeah, maybe a bit more cautious than yeah. <laughs> initially because it didn't pan out so well. Is there any good terrain that, that that's going to favor the defense? No, it's all step. It's all flat yep, and some into it desert. On the steps too. Yeah. And Russia seems confident with that, but there are a lot of Nepalese armies down oh, here. And they are going to take it yep, in Narim. Oh, no. Okay, so Russia got there first. I guess they didn't see how many people were behind. Oh, but some of them have committed to movement, so we're going to have to take that battle. There we go. And now... Shagatai, not with a strong start with that morale hit. No, I, yeah, why are they coming? I think they forgot to bring... Oh, they have their, 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 their base morale is really weak, yeah. actually. What mil tech are they? Let me see here. They're 18. Yes, not bad, but Russia has so much They're morale actually and ahead discipline. ahead of Russia militarily. Oh my god, they're getting a beat down yeah, by like... Oh god, painful for the them. reinforcement might not even come in time. They are movement locked. Russia, oh no, they have arrived, so now Russia might be just... Oh yeah, they are losing that one actually because of the reinforcement. And they only... No, nope, nope. Yep. Ooh, and uh, Silly is losing Russia a made a mistake. battle they, right now. They forgot how slow it is to move on those steps, and they did not send their reinforcement in time. Let's see. Oh, uh, it was too late. I just came back to it see was, silly packing. Yeah, it was 163k silly troops against uh, 100, I believe, Westphalians. They got slaughtered. It is not looking good for silly here. No, indeed. Uh, Serbia is making some slow gain and pushing toward Trebizon. Uh, oh sorry, little, little Treviso, not Trebizon. That's a, that's that's not the Wrong same part. place. <laughs> 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 Close Wrong enough. But yeah, I mean the the Pope is considering bringing up the fight because I guess they have to. Oof. Yeah, if they don't fight on Treviso, then they and and Serbia not wasting time to send reinforcements. They just send everything that they got immediately that might not be good for their yeah, maybe reinforcements i'm assuming the players are losing some patience now uh because now they're starting to overstack the cavalry uh that they got because their first rank has taken so many losses it takes forever for them to go back they are coming back in the first rank they have lots of reasons but yeah look to the north at the westphalia silly conflict um, it looks like Silly sent in a stack of 170k with very little morale, with not trickling in reinforcements, and they are... We are going to pay the price. They are losing Oh, God, yeah, army. yeah, that Oof. is bad. Let's go and go, going back. Though. The Pope is actually winning that one, although, although Serbia has reinforcements. I'm not sure those reinforcements are going to be enough. Uh, it doesn't seem to be turning the tide. They have gotten some reinforcement but they only have 20,000 people willing to f nope nope they are sent packing uh it it's go it's going down to the wire every time it's going to be a battle of attrition there is also now a i believe fake war between Desmond and Mamlocks but Mamlocks are not paying for military maintenance so this must oh, be oh the Desmond conquest of Cape Coast are, are they trading colonies yeah it could be Desmond is back out i didn't realize that oh yeah, uh, the people who played Desmond originally and been recalled like four times on the last kill asked if they could get Desmond back again. <laughs> oh, and we are seeing another big battle in Narim again. This time Russia may have learned from their mistake and send the reinforcements a bit earlier because it takes forever to uh, to walk through those steps. Yeah, I have you need to be there myself. in time. But there is a lot of Chagatai and Nepalese sitting around. So they need to dish out a lot of damage because they have a very, very good uh, general. 6-5 it is giving them pain, but they have insane amount of numbers to pull against. I thought Russia had more people than now. They have more stacks, but but they those stacks have been way. like, yeah, sitting behind. And meanwhile, they have been sent packing. Yep. They're also now, I believe, another one of those uh, fake wars, but Gotland has declared on Russia for St. Petersburg, so... 
What are they going for? I'm not sure. It must be some sort of... Uh, let me go check their missions. Why is Scotland about? Are they trying Scotland to... Scotland must be doing some very strong diplomacy. That's what it's got to be. They are... Yeah, they are currently... Let's see. Yeah, I'm not sure what they're going for. Because they gave back Scotland. Oh, did they declare war on Russia so they could lose and give back the provinces mm. uh, in the peace deal? Okay, 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 okay. But why did they do that? Uh, let me look at the religious map. Well, did they flip the, uh, the, the... No, they did not flip the religion or anything. I, I think they wanted to click an event uh, yeah. or, or something, and I don't know what the point was, but they did it. Uh, Silly Westphalia again going on. Looking... Kingdom of God is out of manpower, so we'll see what happens with that. King yeah, sorry, I uh, I was looking at chat real quick. Gotland so missions, you say? Hmm. Okay, so Serbia has pulled back, trying to lick their wounds. <sighs> I think this is going to be an inconclusive war. I don't see that war uh, ending up in anything but. Uh, Westphalia is white slaughtering piece. silly. Yes. I don't Sealy. know. Oh God, silly has just no. Yeah, they have numbers, but but, and they're on a mountain. God, they're getting beaten up on a yeah, mountain because their morale is just so bad. Their troops just don't want to fight this. What are silly's ideas? Didn't they go for offensive economy, quantity, trade, quality? Okay. They I mean, went for a lot of ideas. I guess they don't have a lot of military bonuses in their base. Uh, I don't know. Their, their base IDs are not g great, I guess. They're, I mean, if you want to fight, they're not great. Uh, and unless they could form something to get out of this, and I don't think they can. Um, Shagatai on the verge of bankruptcy. Let's see, because they've got quite a few... Army's out. I don't know which ones are Mercs. Looks like quite a few, though. Yeah, how is the Shagatai economy going? Uh, That's great. Oh, they have 11k in the bank, but I think they maxed They're that on loans. They're losing 300 ducats a month. Okay, so they maxed that on loans. Uh, and the, tr the, the classic thing of taking loans as soon as you can, because as, 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 as you lose land to occupation, your like, money per whatever changes and you can take more loans. It's, it is a thing. Russia also taking some loans. But nowhere near uh, that. They are not like on the attrition side. They can do it. They can do this whole day. They still have 108k, uh, while um, Shagatai only has 20k in the bag. Nepal is entirely tapped oh, out. Yep, that's yep, yep, yep. Chat, this is a dress, but we're at war. Chat, it's not about the clothes. Chat, it's not about <laughs> this the clothes. This is not a CK stream. <laughs> <laughs> dress DLC for EU for when? Yeah. Uh, oh my gosh, Arista having rebel problems. I didn't even want to click down that far. I hope Shagatai can get themselves out of this hole that they've gotten themselves in. Silly is mostly occupied. Oof. Have, am I missing another war? No, I think we're still all on the same people. Russia slowly moving in. They need to concentrate their force because this is a lot of people on both sides. Let's look quickly. Like, I think Silly is just going to get merged. They are trying. You over. Know? Oh, they got a good battle here, yeah, actually. They're uh, just getting... Like, using the maneuvering power, they managed to uh, to take them separately. But, oh, my God, it's a minus two for Stefan Forv and Silly. And I think when your up. name is Silly... They're backing up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They and they're running out that. of space to 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 hide. Yeah, and good forts. They do. Oh, have their Serbia. Norms. Meanwhile, is trying oh. to. The Pope has pushed, I think, in the grab. The twentieth flag battles in the field of the grab. Uh, oh God, they, they they took the wrong move to try to reinforce. They. Oh no! They, what happened? I thought they were losing, but then they did not. Maybe some. Ba oh, I think one of the Pope leaders died. I don't know what happened, but in the nick of time. The Serbians carried the day yet again, and they have more manpower in the bank, I'm assuming, than uh, God himself. 
Yeah, God God wills it, but he cannot will manpower into existence, sadly. God created man, but no manpower. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> oh, also a problem is that the invasion of Scilly uh, by Westphalia is starting to block out oh like no. uh, Serbia's option for maneuver. And honestly, if I were Serbia, I would tell him, like, get out of my way or I'll just crush you. Yeah. Because, yeah, you know, it could take, like, one stupid retreat to be stuck by Westphalian forces and lose the one-on-one -on, -one on a technicality. Uh, yeah, and also, as long as they're here trying to siege the Pope, like, they cannot go down to Sicily. They need to resolve that fight one way or the other. I. Oh, Sicily is taking... Oh, no, no. They're taking oh. a battle right now. Wow, they're bringing so many troops. Oh, no, but they backed off. Oh, I should... Have, I should yeah... Like, especially that, that thing, like, they only have a very small passage that needs to be occupied by their enemy. Uh, maybe, maybe Sealy is low-key banking on that. The fact that uh, without help... Oh, that's not a bad start because they, they just don't do enough damage. Even if they manage to get there first and get the enemy in a bad spot, they just can't do enough damage. Look at the numbers. They're taking, like, they're taking one for when they're dishing two. Like, this is just... Uh, poor silly. Oh, we're going to reinforce in time. Oh, we're going to reinforce in time. Uh, if they don't reinforce in time, that's going to be bad. Oh, oh they made it. Okay. <sighs> they made it. I, oh, still I, I, I hear still the loans. I hear the loans. Click, 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 click. <laughs> as the thing is happening. Like, shit, I need... <laughs> I need the loans. I need to fight these people. They're still it's not winning not it, though. It's not enough. They need... They, yeah, they, they just do, 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 do spips. are so... How can they get mm. more morale? Or they, should they get a, 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 an advisor, maybe? They have a discipline advisor at this point. Um, they can't really change policy in the nick of time. They already have uh, the papal uh, blessing to get morale. Yeah, I guess they don't have that many options. To, when you don't have like a base bonus, because Westphalia probably has one, Let's see. Yeah. Serbia right now is, I think, fighting for... Yeah, another battle of Friuli, yep. uh, which is going well <laughs> for the Pope, because, again, these, those, those, um, those fought bonuses uh, are helping out. Or helping out pretty well, although it's 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 razor slim, but they have more reinforcements yeah. uh, on the Pope's side, and I am Think not that's sure. Serbia is tapped out there. Yes, they have twenty k reinforcement. That they are helping, but I don't think they're gonna carry the day. No, they're not gonna carry the day. No, Those um, people are gonna have to pack and go home. How is Russia Shagatai two battles? Uh, it looks like Shagatai has actually pushed Russia <gasps> back. They've lost a lot of their occupations. Oh yeah, Jesus. Um, so oh, Shagatai yeah, they're stuck in a two comeback. battles. Like Shagatai is, I think, pretty smart about their movement because we yep. managed to and it's a lot tie of them down. Step fighting. So it looks oh, like Shagatai. But oh, oh, nope. oh, but that that mm, that battle south nope. was a good win for Russia because they managed to split them and then they're going to win the yep. other battle. And now they get the reinforcements in the uh, back. And, oh. and then those people are going to get stuck too. That's going to be a bunch of uh, of them being, oh uh, no, being caught. That's Shagatai. good move from Russia mm -hmm. here. And you really want some extra mo more movement speed than your opponent in those steps because this is like once you get stuck, yeah, again, you, you keep getting stuck in bad battles and you don't have a lot of time Shagatai, to react. out of manpower, out of professionalism. Uh, and out of... Well, they're going to take a while before they run out of money. Yeah. But they will eventually run out of money and Nepal they really cannot uh, afford to take... Oh, did we just got wipe up? No, I think they did. Oh, no. Oh, they cannot afford to take those losses for much longer. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I wanted to check something real quick. How is it that they have so much more morale uh, than the... Uh, how is Westphalia having so much more morale than Silicon? Because I don't think they have any idea boost. So... Oh, they have increased serfdom, which is minus 10%. Oh, no. They must have got an event that they should never have clicked. Increased serfdom, minus 10% morale. This is really bad. Uh, because on the other side, they managed to get all the way to 6. And not even, like, okay, they have a 10% from the golden era. But that's it. Like It's not like they have a big idea bonus. They did not pick defensive or anything like that. 
I think it just boils down to like, yeah, don't click bad event and also maybe have a golden era. Yeah. Uh, and have CD they taken theirs already? No, uh, it's a good. Yes, they did. Uh, fourteen ninety nine to fifteen forty nine. Well, I guess it's it's time for them to be on the way out. Sadly. Mm hmm. I don't know how long is that bad event gonna last for them because this is really fucky and until they get out of it. Uh, where is it? There's so many money fires. I think uh, that Westphalia right now is currently. They, I think that they know that. Increase so serve them. Oh, that's a really bad event. And, I think they and know it's going to be there it. until 1642. Yeah, increase serve them. Like, this is a trap event, chat. Uh, th it's one of those events that if you don't know and you click the wrong button, you just die because you take 10% morale of the armies for like 25 years. Oh, silly again. I mean, that's. They pick good battles, they just can't push through. But look at those numbers 191k versus 25k, and they are just taking. No, because they lack the discipline yeah, and the morale to just the damage, hit them. Just damage, damage, damage. The dudes just don't want to fight. That must be so frustrating for them. Yes. But Westphalia coming in just absolutely so Trashing them. them. Like, yeah, they're, they're, they're wiping the floor with them, and that is really sad, but there's just. Yeah, Not much you can do when you there's have only those so much they can do. Yeah, exactly. And it is really difficult. I guess a general. I mean, ver 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 king is not that bad. Four five is not a bad general. But and meanwhile, Serbia mm -hmm. got into another fight. And again, it's if it's on Serbian land, Serbia Serbia usually wins the day. I think they both have a bonus to be like the defender plus one as a defender. I can't remember what gives you that. But obviously, you want to be fighting on your terrain. Although the Pope, no, I think the Serbian reinforcement will yeah, carry today. Yeah, I the think day. that is all of the Pope's army right there. I don't think there are any more reinforcements for him. But if they get there in time, which they did, okay. Yeah, and now it's going to be the time for the Pope to get sent packing. Yep, and... Is there any age that's longer than the others? Uh, they're timed by uh, by 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 what triggers the next one. Uh, usually, the age of absolutism is on the clock because it starts as soon as you get global trade, which always almost always spawns in 1600. The age of reformation was short because the Pope stopped the reformation from happening <laughs> for like 25 years, so it was the shortest uh, thing. Somebody wants to look at the casualties. Oh God, um, <coughs> sorry. Uh, a million Serbs have died. Uh, uh, and a few Persians. Uh, a million Italians have died. They're basically reenacting World War One yep. um, ish. The country's not entirely being the same. Serbia was on the same side as 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 Italy in the end. But I mean, that's that's where we're looking at. I think Serbia at this point, just knowing that they uh, have, you know, the professionalism. I'm gonna go check how much they even have left because I think that they are. 50% professionalism versus Kingdom of God. Let's look at Russia. None. Oh, oh. Russia uh, Russia is now making some gains. Shagatai. I saw uh, Shagatai uh, got stack wiped by Russia. Oh. There was like a little 40k yeah, stack reinforcement. Yeah. It's not looking great for Shagatai. Shagatai is not in a good shape. They have a lot of money. They can go wild with those loans. Uh, they, no manpower, though. But they, yeah, they, they have no more dudes. Uh, whatever they're fighting with is what they got. And I think Nepal, still in an okay shape. They still have some manpower left. Manpower gone. If we look back at Silly, these battles are insane. It's 200,000 Silly against 50,000 Westphalians, and they just on a mountain. can't get on it. On a mountain. They, they have minus two, and they're still not winning. And the rolls are not in their favor. Let's also just point out, I watched them roll several zeros, oh several ones. God. Yeah, when you're in, yeah, like you're, when you get the shock advantage and the fourth advantage, that's where you, you want to roll a nine yeah. and hope the other guy rolls a five. Oh, they just, I don't know. Is there a... They should go and pray like the emperor to to get to get better rolls because this is ah finally this is finally a good roll but it's too little too late eight versus two that is really good but that uh, yeah again they still have a hundred and fifteen k manpower in bank though like surprisingly none of them has lost a lot of manpower despite those insane battles yeah the Gotland war uh, good point chat um it does look like Gotland has done their diplomacy they have given up some land and retained their islands. Mm. So it looks like whatever wheeling and dealing they had, they, they schemed. They came out all right. 
Yes. I'm surprised all those countries are still in the war. Romania is technically at war. Persia technically at war. I you guess know, it's and just if the allies really stepped in right funny. now, it would be a game changer because if you look at the numbers, I mean, again, on paper, Kingdom of God and France would probably be losing against the might of Persia, Romania, Russia, and Serbia, but... In practice, only only two are fighting, yes. Yeah. Oh. Uh, oh, wait, actually, France is going in on Switzerland right now. What, what is doing? going on there? Oh, oh. Ah, okay. France has decided that since the only person saving silly at this point, uh, serving Switzerland at this point would be would be uh, uh, would be silly, they might as well crush them. There's yeah, not much Switzerland can do. Uh, I mean, they have mountains, but they don't have numbers. No, they do not. I don't think this is going to look very good for Switzerland. Oof. Although that's that's a really small vector to go and, and eat stuff like and it's all defensible for them. Yeah, like like, <laughs> I mean, they have one province that I guess they want to finish the Romandi state, but then like, it, it would be a really weird stake snake in the Alps they compared could, to Westphalia. Yeah, they could come in through yeah the Italian provinces, but I I don't know. Switzerland Maybe seems to just mission? be waiting. Do we have a mission that is asking them to go and conquer Bern? Uh, they cannot annex Savoy. Uh, they can't have Letas et moi because uh, oh, they need to get more. They need more crown land to uh, to to Louis the Fourteenth. This shit. Uh, so yes, chat. Um, Switzerland did die, uh, and this is now Swabia has reformed Switzerland. I believe the Swiss players moved somewhere in India or Southeast Asia. I don't really remember exactly where, who's who, and who moved where. But this is the new reformed Switzerland. I thought there was an absolutism map mode, but maybe not. I don't know if if oh. countries have started farming it or not. Kingdom of God just lost a big battle on Ooh. Treviso, oh. and it looks like Serbia is pushing. Silly is silly is falling. Silly is uh, is silly. <sighs> silly is in a silly position. Yes, <laughs> indeed. Oh, they're making more troops. It's 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 not gonna look. Uh, mm. Silly is really not in a I good shape now. Yeah. They still have a lot of man, but they're running out of tactical. They're getting pushed north, and I mean, Silly is mm -hmm. driving a wedge. They just. Like, Westphalia can take one fort, and then they're guaranteed that unless they can walk through Romania, they're going to yeah. be stuck north and eventually crushed. And in regards to the Russian war, it looks like they have pushed through Shagatai. They are now moving into Nepal. Oh, wow. I Fighting through those mountains and really bad terrain there. Yeah. I wouldn't want to be there, but I guess... Oh, God, this is really ugly mountains, but also no fort. There's one fort here. That Nepal is looking at. Oh, but they drove a wedge in between the two. Yep. So Shagatai cannot reinforce them easily at all. They would have to come down. And they are trying, I think. No, they're coming from this side. I don't. Maybe they're not in the same room. Because I, I don't know if you you walked around a bench today, right? And you could see during the big wars that some countries happen to be in the same room, but some others, like especially the big coalition mm -hmm. against the Pope, they were like, I think it took two, if any message you had to send, it would take a minute at least to come back. Yep. Like that's you're playing with a minute lag with your friends when you're trying to collaborate. Uh, that's that's not great for collaboration, even if you're only on speed two. And even if you know things weren't going according to plan, you would have two delegations from each team running, and then they would come back, and their information would contradict yeah each contradict other. each other, and then they would be like, "Well, now what do we do?" Looks like oh no, Treviso takes taking a sweet time to fall. Oh, France and uh, Switzerland taking two battles at the same time. Switzerland, though, managed to split the battles in two, but I think they're not going to be able to... Oh, God, they just got wiped. Mm. Uh, the morale, the morale. French morale, always the solution. I know people tell me it's not the meta, but they're wrong. Just, just more morale. How much morale they got now? They should have all the morale. Seven. Now we're talking. Papal blessing, army tradition, power projection... Unadvised military drill. Ah, my boys, they went for defensive, as you should. I still disagree with people. Defensive, best idea. No new news from the Americas. Chat Andalusia is colonizing Brazil, colonizing Jerusalem, colonizing. No movement in between Gotland, Texas, and United States. Just 
blobbing through the natives. And now the Pope is trying to retake. They have to break the Siege of Treviso soon. Uh, and that's usually where it's it's either here or there or that it trend, stops, yeah. right? One of those two is usually where it stops. Oh, meanwhile, Silly, where's our army? Fuck. Oh, did they get pushed and wiped? I can't see Silly's army anymore. Oh god, I. I think no, they they are still alive. They just ran away in Romania. I think Silly's just like. Oh, I see. We're them. gonna die. Oh, no. We're gonna die. Might as well save your army in case someone else jumps you. Yeah. See, the issue is, is that they do have manpower. I mean, can't they try to go do some diplomacy and get some allies on this? Or I mean. I guess if they've been historically diplomacy isolated. They have been. Westphalia, though, as well. For a long time, Westphalia didn't have a single ally, and I was very concerned for them. But then they made their friends, I guess. I mean, with you know Great Britain on your side, what are you gonna? Yeah. No you, one's really messing with you there. No, no, nobody will have the uh, the, the gal to attack you. Okay, on the on the slopes of Treviso, it it looks like a close call. Serbia is is losing it for now, but they're bringing more people. Uh, they still have a very mi very mighty six five five, and again, every time you're attacking, like the defender has a dice roll bonus, on top of uh, being the um, excuse me being the uh, the defender. Uh, no, I think Serbia is gonna send be sent packing again. That minus one yeah. in defense all every time is a real uh, doozy in terms. Serbia of just has manpower for this. I think that they're just going to keep attempting. At this point, I wonder what sort of uh, peace talks that they're having because this was um, Kingdom of God aggression. Yeah. And Serbia has kept them out. Yes. So I don't know exactly what they're going to try to deal with and how they're going to get it. Uh, but yes, I don't know. How do they get the uh, local defender dice roll bonus? Oh, ramparts. New building, I that. didn't know. Ramparts are pretty good buildings. Plus one to rolls. Oh, and Serbia did lose a stack due to a retreat issue. I think it is because of the fact that they have enemies on the way. Again, like they were trying to retreat, but countries were at war with or occupying forts. Uh, so I think that is the issue. Like that, that, that silly war, as is as I mentioned earlier, is costing Serbia a lot because. Due to occupation, they might get caught in the fault zone of control and be unable to retreat. And I think this is... I think if I was Serbia, I would be like, oh, come on, guys. Like, this is not a duel at this point if if I, if I get stuck in there because technically, like... We, they could ask Westphalia to piece them out and say, you know what? We're going to cross through you, but we're not going to fight the... Oh, but they have not. Westphalia just, just, just... Oh, they finally did, actually. I think they finally, yeah, Westphalia finally pieced out uh, with uh, Serbia, but I think they probably did it too little, too late, and that made like the retreat bug out. That is, that is really uh, annoying uh, for them, and yeah, I think that truce. Uh, maybe not. Maybe I choose his order. Anywho, I think the occupations here are messing with the retreat path sometimes, uh, and 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 got Serbia uh, some uh, fun time that they would rather not have. Okay, how do I get rid of this? Uh, I can't. It's just there, I guess. Okay, I got it. What do you think is going to happen when Silly falls, as far as a partition? <sighs> is it going to be a partition if it's just them? No, but I mean, it's not like Westphalia is going to be able to annex the whole thing. So no, after that, true. then it's going to get dogpiled the on. The problem is if they don't have a big vector of attack because Bohemia is in the way and Bohemia is a Swiss vassal. So the only thing they can do is snake through like uh, the Austrian mountains. It's going to be, uh, whatever it is, it's going to be ugly. That's my that's my prediction. Prediction is whatever it is, it's going to be ugly as fuck. Because with Switzerland and its vassal in the way... At best, we can take Bavaria, and it's still going to be looking okay. And then it's going to quickly going to look like the borders of the Gores. Unless they cut a deal with France to partition Switzerland in the in the same mix. Uh, I don't know. Actually... If you're Westphalia, then... Wait, 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 wait. wait. Did France... Did France attack... Uh, did, did France put Sicily as a co-belligerent? 
Uh, no, sorry, this war. It did. I think. Well, the main issue is Westphalia being allied to Great Britain. At least they have that, but they are stuck between some of these pretty large powers. So they need to expand into Sicily. Yeah. They need to. Now the question their is: Will Serbia be like? You know what? At this point, might as well or. Romania? They can't because they're in the war together right now. Serbia is getting absolutely slaughtered. Oh, yeah, I mean, the loss of There's those uh, of those monster stack gives the Pope, like, some momentum on the offensive. I... Yeah, maybe they should start reaching for a piece now. Uh, I don't think anybody's going to get anything out of it. I don't know. Serbia has... I mean, they probably, like, burned some... Uh, yeah, they burned some, uh, some, some, something here to get this tag back. It is, it is sad how, they, uh, how they're doing. People are asking how is Great Britain... They're busy doing nothing, and they're pretty good at it, yep. honestly. They've just been deving. They've Meanwhile, been collecting lots of ducats. They're GP number one, but they have not been in a war in quite some time. No, I think they're, they're sitting and clicking the death button more and mm -hmm. more. Meanwhile, Russia is fighting... On the mountains, we've... What is that? I can't remember what the tag is. Uh, whatever that is, they won. Uh, and they are pushing through that ugly mountain fort that they've been trying to siege forever. Uh, and I guess they're hoping... Yeah, it's it's a long war because they, they have a lot of land to cover to get those people out of the uh, out of here and bring uh, Shagatai to the, to the peace table. Uh, I think that at this point, it might be a Serbian defeat. Possibly. I don't I, f I think if they want to play this safe, they rebuild just enough to be able to kick the uh, the Pope out over and over again, and they don't bother trying oh, to push just them out. They did a lot of troops. Okay. Yes. All right. I, think, I think if I was them... And I, if uh, at this point you just want to get out of there, like it, 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 it is, it is a pointless war. You're not gonna get anything. Uh, just figure out a way to uh, kick the Pope out of uh, of your land and just wait. Just sit on it and say, "Come on, oh, the Pope is really pushing to get yeah. the siege of That's Zagreb." That's sixty-four percent. Although to be fair, it? it's not a big deal because even if they take it, it's a yeah, plane. It's, they yeah, can always take it back real quick. It does have deal. a rampart, which means they're gonna get minus one if they try to fight them on it. But I think that's the play for them. They they kick the poop out and just sit on this and say, you know what? I'm not gonna bother murdering more of my manpower going yeah, after you. Yeah, and getting you. stuck in the silly Westphalia situation. Yeah, exactly. Either. Crossing just that corridor is so dangerous for them. Yep, 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 yep. Don't bother. Just, just, just sit this one out and uh, and go. Okay, Sealy is minus ninety nine percent, but no peace deal is being sent. Uh, maybe they are just negotiating because it doesn't seem like uh, Westphalia is going to bother getting 100%. Yep. They are messing at the Swiss border right now. I think that it is very dangerous to be Switzerland and very dangerous to be silly right yeah, now. Yeah, I think I think uh, I, I think somebody should put a label on Switzerland and say like careful this is a health risk. <laughs> <right?" laughs> oh man, if I was them I would be attempting to secure some better alliances right now. Yep. Oh, the Pope is getting. Oh, oh, that's that's interesting. The Pope is getting like delayed by a bunch of like by reform, reform zealots, zealots and silly, <laughs> which I think Serbs are gonna use as a, as a as a reason to push out and try to get their uh, their stuff back. Well, unfortunately for us, at this super important time, and all of these wars are going on, it is time to for a change. change casters. It is time for a change. So, chat, ch thank ch you guys. Changing. We are getting to the end of the end here, riveting gameplay at the third day of Grandis Land. And run for lunch while it's still open. Yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> I'm hungry. <laughs>